through. All right, Shalom. We GM Master New Orleans coming back at you with another camp. We come in from week in and week out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon, the dawn of Babylon, known as America in the scriptures. But prior to get started, as we always do, we like to give infinite honors and prayers to Yahweh Bahashem, Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Salutation to the Arkham that's pushing the truth and sincerity. Lord willing, this video be edifying first and foremost to the whole feed. Let then to those that cleave to the body. And what better way to talk of than judgment, man? You see? Matter of fact, start me off with Psalms. Psalms. That one? Yeah. Go ahead. It's the book of Psalms, chapter 9, verse 16. Yeah. Yahweh is known by the judgment which he executed. Beautiful. The, Yahweh is what? Known by the judgment which he executed. Yahweh is whom the world ignorantly calls God or the Most High. All right. His name is Yahweh, which means he is. He exists. He's the be. Okay. That's the heavenly father. All right, which is separated from Yahweh Shai, his son. That's two different people, man. All right, go ahead. Nah. He's known for what, though? Yahweh is known by the judgment which he executed. He's known by the judgment which he executed. By him, actions are weighed. Okay? The law and judgment is always in the earth. And that's why he set up his prophets to speak forth this judgment. Give me that Psalms 37. <laughs> Book of Psalms 37. 37 and 37. 30. 30. Look at the signs. This is uh Psalms 37 and 30. Go ahead. Psalms 37 and 30. It says the mouth of the righteous speak wisdom. Right, and first and foremost, the mouth of the righteous is this prophets. All right, and tell you ain't give me Hosea 12 and 10, brother. Hey, okay. Well, what we're saying, all right, we're speaking of the uh salvation of the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. What, what's your father? You're you are you uh Latino? You Spanish? What are you? You're Jewish, okay. Well, by your right, father, by your father, okay. Mother and father, okay. Well, well, we would have to know. We, we would have to know your father because you're saying you're Jewish, which we basically we just gonna try the spirit by the spirit. All right, your father comes from what land? What land did do they come from? Europe. From Europe. Okay, so hey, we'll just go with that for now. All right. Well, in the, in the scriptures, it's prophesied about those those the line and what you come from. It's called Esau Edom. All right, if you're, uh, or if you're aware of that, you know what Esau means? Okay, Esau is the uh, the progenitor of the so-called white people you would call today, all right? It, the white people, that name is not white. That was a term, came in what, 18? 16. 16? 1681. 1681, all right, that they put up on the people, so was black, all right? But Esau is whom the Lord uh, have indignation for forever. They are the so-called white people today, according to biblical prophecy, all right? Whose judgment of the Lord is to be put into slavery a thousand years and to be killed afterwards, all right? And now, right now, those people are ruling the earth in the Job 9 and 24. Your people is ruling the earth, according you, to the scriptures. You know about anything about the Belfort Declaration? But the Belfort, Belfort Declaration. Yeah, just right now. Just right Which? Right. The, 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 the Bel Belfort Declaration. You know about that? I how it established the land of Israel back then, 1948, 1947. Okay. But we, we might get into a little bit of that. Go ahead. with the Job. It's the book of Job, chapter 9, verse 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. Right. So right now the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. All right. Which is Edom. Okay, and by the by the earth being under his possession right now, everything is out of his course, man. Okay, uh, wickedness have exalted itself. The violence men walking on every side when the wicked is in authority, according to Psalms twelve and eight. So right now, your people is ruling with a with a uh, with a, uh, a hand of iron. 
all right, over the people. They're oppressing the poor people. The, the Edomites today, all right, which is so-called white people, they're oppressing these people, which are the chosen people of God, okay? Are you aware of that? So you don't know any of these people on this sign, right? They go by the by, by words of Negroes, all right, West Indians, Haitian, Dominicans, you got Judah, all right? What you see over here is the biblical names, and over here is their by words and proverbs, okay? So right now, we're in the hand. Give me Exodus 31. Y'all, uh, your people have stole these people. It's Jeremiah right? 14, so, two. Yeah, Jeremiah 14, 2, 2. Give me Exodus. Let's say, put the prompt in his hand. Because your people have stolen these people. And right now, have them into captivity this day. They taken them by way of transatlantic slave trade and cast them on auctioning blocks according to the book of Joel. Okay? And are oppressing them in, in, in North America right now. All right? Just over this. Yeah, in the thing. So, what? Salaki. But right now, go ahead. Yeah, go, go ahead. It's uh, the book of Ezekiel, chapter 36, verse 5. Yep. Thus saith the Lord God, surely in the fire of my jealousy have uh -huh. I spoken against the residue of the heathen yep. and against all Idumia, yep. which have appointed my land. Idumia is Greek for Edom. Okay? That's Greek for Edom, which have appointed his land. Go ahead. Which have appointed my land into their possession. In their possession. So right now, like he spoke about the Belfort Declaration, right now Esau is occupying, well, you got the Arabs, you know, different nations, but they have pointed their land, which the land of the Lord is Israel, chiefly, okay, Jerusalem, which is above is free, which is the mother of us all. But they have appointed their land. Even if, all this is the Lord's land, technically, man, right? Because everywhere the soul and feet of these people is at, they're going to inherit so technically, all this is for the Lord. But the wicked is in control of it right now. Go ahead. It says, the residue of the heathen and against all Idumia, yep. which have appointed my land into their possession yep. with the joy of their heart, yep. with the spiteful minds uh -huh. to cast it out for a prey. And, and when you go into the land of Israel, chiefly right now, they have uh, they have tattoo parlors. All right. You have Tel Aviv. Okay. They, they're, uh, what they're importing, uh, trees and grass. All right, they're making merchandise of the land, right? They are they setting up there. Don't they sell stuff for David? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, they are souvenirs. souvenirs for King David. All right, they are they are they have made merchandise of the Lord land, man. All right, go ahead. And they're not the people, and they are not the people of the most high, they're the most wicked. And get, get that in prayer, Azariah one and uh, and, and Apocrypha that say they are the most wickedest people of the most high. Got more? God, this is uh, Jeremiah chapter this, 14. This is it. Verse 2. Yep. Judah mourneth and the gates thereof language. Right. When you go into Judah, right, you have, you know, Jew, uh, short for Jew, but you have Judah, which is the tribe of the Negroes, but you also go to Judah. That's the southern kingdom, the house of them as well. Okay. They're mourning. These people are mourning on this sign. Along with these, the northern tribes, all right, we're all one family. Okay, but we're they're all mourning because they're oppressed. Go ahead. Which is a cut to the so-called that's right, so-called yeah. Jewish people today. They're because mourning. they're not in mourning, they own everything, they own America, right. they own they own Hollywood, banks, the banks, you name it. And they, and they call themselves Jewish for a reason because the, the the I S H on the end means it's pertaining to. Pertaining to. Yeah. So if I had if I had on ashy blue jeans, you had on dark blue jeans, my my shit would be called what? Blue wish. Blue wish. No, right. It's not the real. It's not necessarily the real thing. What's they told? What's they told themselves, man? Yep. Right. And we can, we can. It's only, it's only how you want to apply. We can, we can go deeper. Okay. Yeah. We can go actually deeper. My brother, my brother got the get it real fast. Got the Belfort Declaration right here. All right. All right, my man. You know. Bring it out. Oh, what you got, out? What you got? Jewish. Tell me this. You gotta go. Tell me this. Islam is about 1600 to 1700. Everything is the price. Christianity is about 24, 25. Watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. Obviously, we're the end of the so we can get a look up there. That's why I'm giving the price. 
Before Christianity, you got Judaism. Correct? Judaism. Now, watch this, watch this. That's about, let's say, 3,400 as well, too. Right? Now, if I, what's your fucking I'm going to get them. I'm going to get them. Here's the deal. If I can estimate these particular things involving on the planet, right? Now, my next question is, where did the Hebrews, Judaism, get their information from? To put together their actual doctrine. Where did Christianity get there? They get it from the Hebrew. Where did Islam get there? They get it from the Christian. So my point here is, who are the real Christians? Though? Who are the real Christians? Every God is all of that. No, 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 no. I'm asking no question. I'm asking no question. Who is the real Christians? The last beginning of Christianity, but if you go back here in North America, but before North America. Christianity evolved over in another world. You can't, you can't say Christianity without understanding who are the real Christians. Let's, Let's, you know you know. Let's say you know who they are. No, we know who they are. Okay, no. now here's my point. All right. My point is about the time frame, brother. We're not Egyptian. No. Nope. Not Sumerian. No. Nope. Not. You're not. Okay, until you go in, until you ask the question of where did the Hebrews get their information from? Because we don't get to this present day time frame or any of this. We're going to the Bible. In regards to the the uh, the the the, uh, the, 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 the Quran, in regards to uh, the, the Hebrews and everything, we don't get to this point. You know what the Quran means. But here's what I'm saying to you. What I'm saying to you is, you got to ask the question: Where did they get it from? Because see, you and I, we don't get to this point to be here to be able to express all of this until we get to the origin and the source of where. No, 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 no. That's, that was written about 1600s as well, too. That no, means, no, no, man, no, 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 no. William Shakespeare didn't write the no. Bible. We're not talking about that either. Where did this information come from, brothers? You're going to teach. Listen, are you, listen. Are you going to listen? I'm doing it, I'm doing it at the same time. Question. Now we got, I, know, I know the information in regards to the in between about Shakespeare and all these other, the, 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 uh, the, uh, the, 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 the Catholics actually put it together in an actual table where, the where King James. the 1600s. You so, at the 1600s? No, the book was no. written in the 1600s. No, with no, books, though. No, the actual Bible itself. No, the King James in 1611. Translation. Correct. All right. The, the, trans the translation. Now we're going to the language portion of That's the key thing here. That's what's critical, brother. If you think about the language here, now you think about going back further than just what you think in regards to the Hebrews, because you don't get to this portion right here unless you're actually utilizing the Jews' information. The what Hebrew the, information. What did you? That's the, that's the point. The, when you talk about the Jews, brother, when you talking about the Jews, let me ask you this: When you were talking, when you were telling him about the Canaanites, when you were Jews, you haven't answered any question, brother. The only question, but don't ask. Don't finish. The two. Well, we well, we already know who the Jews. No, no, you're standing right here. You're standing right here, brother. Okay, we standing right here. Yeah. Who are they? You see, you got two sets of. Come on, who are they? You got the white set, and you also have you got your. Look, but before the Arabs actually actually took over with you man, this thing goes back to about 45. Man, you ever heard of the black the destruction of black civilization? Any of you ever ever seen that black uh, uh, by Sheikh Antidea? Yeah, we you, you read the chance. Yes, you've seen it, right? There's no such thing as a black civilization. That was, the, no, no, such, there's no such thing as a black that's a social construct. We know, we know it's a social construct. Man. I understand you get to the white and the black and on social construct. I understand right. that. I understand that, but what I'm saying because that was because religion was used. Religion is not even spiritual. Religion was used you know as what a what was religion used for? As a form of what? what we needed to what? Conform means, people's behavior. It means just what the word means. The word religion means religio. It means to restrain back to a whole and restrain back. No, but that's what religion does. Religion is what I know, but it's a construct like the brother said over here. It is a construct, it's a construct to do what? Control, to conform man. and control. Religion, we don't want to do a worship. So, so which All means right, what? Religion? Worship. That's key. That's key. Too. Worship that's key. Too. That's key too. Too. Which means what? We got to go back to what? The spiritual. If you destroyed and completely wiped out the spiritual, cultural history of us, it never people, was wiped out. It never was wiped out. It was always in the Bible. I don't mean wiped out. That, that was, what I'm saying to you, you have what is the, you have what is called a control of information. You have elite. That's why we're in the age of information now. See, before this right here, a lot of us didn't even have the knowledge. Because, look, think about it. Knowledge, right there, right there. 
What's your nationality? What's your nationality? What is your nationality? What is your nationality? You call yourself teaching us. We don't need you to teach us. We don't need you to teach us. What is your nationality? What's your nationality? What's your nationality? What is your nationality? You went. You went through a whole. All that. You don't know your nationality. You don't know who you are. What? That's the wrong kind of trying to make to you, brother. No. What's your nationality? This is when it comes to when it comes to when it comes to over here, right? Look, watch this. If my ancestors came on the ship over here, right? No, if they came here. And, 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 and all of a sudden, my people say, I got somebody saying, this is the religion that you're going to actually have to worship. You have to teach me right now. You can teach me like you listen to how we preach. No, we're not done now. You ain't answering none of our questions, right? You gotta answer some of the questions. I right. reciprocate, bro. That's the real deal. We, listen to you? we don't deal with in the way we're dealing with facts. I'm right. dealing with facts too. Well, you aren't showing the facts. That's why we got the answer. That's the whole point. That's the oh, yeah, truth. but you haven't pulled anything up. The truth don't need but anyway, it. Anyway, it's going to we're gonna go all the way back to the Christmas. Yeah, the truth have an explanation behind it. Beyond this story, there's something before the Everything that's going to chapter 4, verse 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. They what? My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. This is his people, all right? The so called Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans, all right? His people, the Lord said, My people is destroyed for a lack of knowledge. They are saddest children, yes. all right? They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they don't have no knowledge, all right? He learned that jailhouse prison, okay, thinking that we, we are, certain things came before the Bible. No, man, all right? You got to come learn your history before you talk to be a teacher, man, okay? That's a mystery in history that seem, nobody seemed to have, man, but the, the prophets of the Lord got it, and they know the order. You're just telling us, brother. Can't teach if you don't know nothing. You can't you teach if you don't know nothing. You saying you black? Yeah. Nobody is. Whoever this color, get the man some help, man. He's dying. That's, nobody is black. That's nobody not white. Yeah. The man is dying. You look like this, you're dying. I right? go ahead, brother. Which we know too. When you look up, anytime you go into any uh any of these forms of dictionary, Oxford, Merriam-Webster, you look up the word black. It has every negative connotation kind of to it that you can name. Negative, boy, dead, you name it, man. Then when you look up uh, what white mean, it has every positive connotation to us. Innocent, pure, blase, yeah. blase. All right? But, uh, but that's what you get from a South Carolina Jacob, man. Them, them Geechee niggas be tripping, man. Yeah, yeah. You know? Dollar, dollar, yeah, them Geechee niggas be tripping, bro. You think he taught us something? Yeah. But said a whole lot of nothing. Well, before this, this a whole lot of nothing, man. All right? That's why the Lord going to kill you for being destroyed. Matter of the Lord going to kill you for being ignorant. Yeah. No, you got to die for that. So to not know or ignore the fact of, you're going to die for that, right? Because he ignoring the fact of what the Lord want us to know and what we're supposed to know. Go ahead, brother. God. It says, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge yeah. because thou has rejected knowledge. Yeah, what? Because thou has rejected knowledge. And just like he just did, rejected. We was about to teach him the history. All right? We was going to go into those missing parts of how we get here. Okay, there's breadcrumbs that led to him, man. The sign. All right, just catch the sign. Take pictures of the sign. It says, Yeah, yeah you, you this a freak, bro. Yeah. Go ahead. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. Yep. That thou shalt be no priest to me. Yep. Seeing that thou hast forgotten the law of thy power, yep. I will also forget thy children. So now these children are forgotten. He's one of those that forgotten and been rejected of the Lord. Okay, the Lord remembered us and allowed us to come back into this faith off mercy. All right, but when we come to teach our people to tell him to come back into the law, statutes, and commandments, the Bible, our regular history, not with the history the so-called white man gave us, man. All right, Jake don't understand that. Jake don't know history, man. Jake just think we here. Which, in a way, you by what said that the that the thoughts and the, and the scriptures were written by the Most High Himself. That it came, was. came, the thoughts and everything came down through men. But to tell you in the, in the old testament, the Lord said, I wrote, I wrote everything on the title with the pen of my what did it say? Uh his finger. With my finger. Yeah, with, with his finger. Second Timothy 360. There's another one about the diamond. You know? Yeah, he asked it with the point of the diamond. I mean the, the point, man. 
You got it. Go ahead. Second uh, Timothy three and sixteen. Yep. Go ahead. It says all scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High. Of who? Of the Most High. Give me Job thirty two and seven. Read that again. It says Second Timothy three and sixteen. All scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High. So it's inspired by the Spirit of the Lord. First and foremost, you can't understand any of these scriptures if the Rakapadas, which is the Holy Spirit, if it don't have an unction unto you. If your house shall not suffer with you, there's no way for you to understand this. All right. And you got to be chosen of the Lord. OK, go ahead, brother. It says all scripture is given by inspiration of the most high and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. Right. And that's, and that's what the, the, the men of the law was set out to do. All right now, I know some of us got baby faces in different ages, but in the end time, the Lord told you that he, he did it every time. Every time the Lord is going to destroy a kingdom, what he does, he sends his men out on the highways and byways, as we're doing, all right, to preach unto the people and warn them what's going to happen, man. And everybody that he can, everybody of the elect that he can bring in, he's going to deliver and save, man. But everybody else, he's going to die. Right? Just as Noah did, just as all the prophets that warned did, man. But what, what, happened, what, what happened, though? Our people that's on the side, they fucked up. They got, they come with their own form of doctrine, philosophy, ideas, and beliefs, man. Which the Lord ain't dealing with none of that. The Lord ain't dealing with the scriptures, man. And what the truth, what truth sake is, man. We don't want to get, we don't get, I'm kind. We don't want to give a damn, we don't give a damn about Allah, Buddha, uh, Krishna, none of those goddamn make-believe characters, man. Jesus. And, and, and Jesus too, this guy. Yeah, we don't care about Jesus. We don't, we don't, the Bible is not about this guy. This guy, this is a this, this is a made up character, man. Yeah. By the name of uh, Serapis Christus. All right. This guy is not going to deliver you in the time time to come. All right. This was a this was a tool set up by the so called white man to deceive the world, which he accomplished through this. This guy, man. All right. And that's what our people, y'all, y'all niggas, you know, they own that shit. But go ahead, what your precept is real quick? I got a quick precept. Uh, Jeremiah chapter uh, four. Uh huh. Yeah, I remember you. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, what, what's your fault? Or your grand, your grandfather, your grandfather, your father. What's their name? What's their race? What you consider? Would, would it be West Indian? Say black. Yeah, black. Just answer it that right. Okay. Hey, well, more than likely you you were born and raised here, right? Yes. So more than likely you come from one of these one of these tribes. Negro, West Indian, or Haitian. Israelite. You were Israelite. You were Israelite for sure. So now, would when you answer, you say your nationality? I'm Israelite. Like, reason why we ask that because sometimes just because just because. With this color, that doesn't mean that we're not. That don't mean we are uh, gay or uh, uh, so-called Puerto Ricans. So you got dark-skinned Puerto Ricans, you know. So that's why I ask that. But if your father, whatever your father, your grandfather is, because the Lord, give me uh numbers one and eighteen. Oh, bring it out then, if you got it. Numbers one and eighteen. It says, and they assembled all the congregation together on the first day of the second month, and they declared their pedigrees. After their families by the house of their fathers. So whatever your father is, you tell and tell tells what pedigree you're what where you come from, what your lineage is. So if you if and it matters by your father, because your father has what? He holds the seed. Your mother just the she represents like the earth uh, uh incubator. Your daddy puts the seed in her, whatever he is, make you. Now it say and color does and like, really and truly the color doesn't matter. You know, you can be dark skinned, you can be like you have a Negro, so-called West Indian guy. Get with a white woman, his child can come out, but it's still, it's still what their father is, still based on what the father is. Because you know, over here in the west, in the west, western hemisphere, they're all about color, 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 black and white, not based on what a man father is. Because you got, you got like, uh, what's his name? Uh, uh, Blake Griffin. Blake Griffin's father is a, is a whole Jamaican man, but he looked white though, yes, because it's not about, it's about the seed of the man. It's not about the mother, it's about the, it's about, yeah, yeah, but that's what, you more, man, you, you more than likely one of these tribes, man, Judah, Judah, Benjamin, or Levi, man, more than likely, you know, based on your father, your grandfather, all right, we're going to run it though, all right, 
Oh, yeah, I went back. <laughs> it's the book of Job, chapter 32, verse 8. Back, back to the, the, the scriptures that we read. Uh, Job, chapter 32, verse 8. Uh, Job, chapter 32, verse 8. Uh, Job, is given by the most high man, all right. And through through that, through the spirit, the Lord has put men in place. Get that get that second Peter one and twenty. You got it? All right, come on, go ahead. Second Peter one and twenty. Knowing this first that no prophecy of the scripture is any private interpretation. So no prophecy of these scriptures is of any private interpretation, meaning no one man can come and privately interpret the Bible. Or teach it to you in any kind of way. All right. The inspiration is given of the most high. Which you still you still holding that on Second Timothy, right? This verse 16. No, don't get off that. Go ahead. There's more. This verse 21. For the prophecy came not in old time by the will of man, yeah. but holy men of the most high speak as they were moved by the Holy Ghost. So the holy men, the set apart, holy means separate or set apart, was moved by the Holy Spirit. By the, moved by the Holy Spirit, man. Hey, I keep showing this. You have an unction to know all things. Yeah, go ahead. You finish? That's it? Go ahead. It's the book of Job, chapter 32, verse 8. But there is a spirit in a man. That's a what? A spirit in a man. Go ahead. And the inspiration of the Almighty giveth them understanding. So the inspiration of the Most High give the prophets the understanding. All right? And also those men that he... That he gave that spirit to y'all so consecrated. Give me first Corinthians 1, 20, second Corinthians 1, 20, 21, 22, 20. It's the book of first John, chapter 2, verse 20. Yo. It says, But ye have an unction from the Holy One, and ye know all things. So you have an unction. When you go into that word unction, it means the endowment of the recapodas of the Holy Spirit. To be endowed means the angels are assisting with the Hawashai authority. You, he has sent angels to what? To help you formulate and articulate the scriptures with understanding, man. So the inspiration is coming in the most high, man. All right? We don't know the scriptures on our own. That's no way for us to know this like this. Jake, look at us. Oh, man, you've been studying and doing this. You can study and you're blue in the face. They got many theologians, the theologians, different men, pastors that study day and night. I'm talking about never, ever stop studying. And they don't understand the scriptures. So unless the inspiration of the Most High uh, be given unto you, you can't get it. In John 3 and 27, it says a man can receive nothing except it be given him from the heavens, man. You see? Go ahead, brother. Well, the scripture said, you don't choose me, but I choose you, man. John 15. But there's anything about you can buy the truth, you can do this. The, hey, Lord, do Lord, the Lord from the heavens has to choose you in order to get this, man. You got to be pulled from the earth and pulled from out of the world, all right, and brought into the world of the Most High, man. That's right. Right, this is a world within the world, technically. You know, you got to be chosen, huh? The Lord said that. I, I pray to not take you out of the world, but to to stay in and endure. Yeah. It's uh real quick. This Hebrews one and one. The Most High Yahweh, yeah. who have sundry times yeah. and in diverse manners mm -hmm. spake in times past unto the fathers by the prophets. By the prophets. When you get Luke, what one and seventy, your favorite. Uh -huh. All right. Get eight. Get Hosea twelve and ten. Bible Gashah. Hosea 12 and 10. Let's grab that right quick. Go to that on Luke 1 and 7. It's the book of Luke. Stay with that. Chapter 1, verse 68. Blessed be the Lord Yahweh, the God of Israel. The, he, the God of who? Of Israel. Of these people. The Lord is dealing with these people, man. He's not dealing with everybody. Go ahead. For he had visited and redeemed his people. Go ahead. And have raised up a horn of salvation for us yeah. in the house of his servant David. As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets. As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets that he gave the inspiration to. Okay? The spirit was moved on these men. All right? Through the fear of the Lord that come out and speak the Bible, man. As it was moved on the other prophets. Jonah. All right? Uh, Daniel. All these other men, man. Okay? They had the spirit of the Lord with them. Elijah. Elisha, all these men. Isaiah. Isaiah. Right, go ahead. Which have been since the world began. So been since the world began. So the men that are speaking today, the, the, the spirit of the prophets is subject unto the prophets. The ones that are speaking today, they were speaking of a full time, man. All right, this ain't nothing new. It look new. Men that are in new bodies, all right, but the same spirit. Go ahead, I. Right? Hosea 12 and 10. Go ahead. I have also spoken by the prophets. And I have multiplied visions and new similitudes by the ministry of the prophets. Yeah. 
So he spoke it by the prophets, huh? Okay? The law word, the true prophets, the law word ain't gonna fall vain. There are many vain teachers and talkers, man. All right? The spirit of the Lord, if a man got the spirit of the Lord, he was ordained of the spirit, man. Okay? Which it says in plenty of scriptures, New Testament, the ones who were ordained a full time, predestined. All right? Go ahead. Uh, this is uh, 2 Corinthians. You finishing that? One. Come on, go ahead. 2 Corinthians 1 and 21. It says, now we which establish it. Yo. So I can. Now we which establish it us with you in Hamashiach yeah. and have anointed us is our power. So he will establish us with the Lord, with Yahweh Shai is our heavenly father, Yahweh. So Yahweh Shai is sanctioned to the men he needed to go to. All right. When he came to the earth, when he went, got Matthew, John, he knew exactly who he was going to. He wasn't somewhere wandering off. Oh, that man looked like he may know the word. You come with me. No, Man. you come with me, you back to he picked 12 particular men. All right. Same way the Lord is doing today. All right, go ahead, brother. Verse 22. It says, Who had also sealed us? Who had what? Who had also sealed us? So the men that teach the word of the Lord is sealed. Okay, go ahead. And given the earnest of the spirit and given the heart. earnest of the spirit in their what? To uh to given the earnest of the spirit in our heart. And their spirits, man. All right. Have the earnest of the spirit in their heart. That unction to know all things, man. Right? You got some? Go ahead. It's uh, St. Luke chapter 10, verse 16. Go ahead. He that heareth you, heareth me. So the ones that hear us hear the Lord. But we don't look like it, right? Hey, it, but get that in Acts where it said, if this is not of the Lord, it will come to north, man. Wait, 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 you know what I'm saying? From the beginning, you know what I'm saying? So they was already hand picked from the, you know what I'm saying, from the great king that sits on thorns, Yahweh. You know what I'm saying? So either way it go, you know what I'm saying? If, 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 if you prophesied back then, you prophesied right now. You know what I'm saying? There's no new thing under the sun. It's no coincidence. You know what I'm saying? So one thing about it, once you hear that lovely song, you know what I'm saying? You're going to get locked in. You're going to just, boom, you know, just like I did. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I heard the song, boom. I, I fell right in line, just like the disciple. It's like you said, walk well, so. right. That song is until that until the one forty four man. That's it. Hey, the Lord is a cherry picker. When you look up what cherry picking means, it means to choose selfishly. All right, the Lord chose particular men according to His self will, according to His will. That's what cherry pick means, man. All right, and that's what He did the men of the Lord. Okay. What we supposed to bend to is a like I said, a beacon of righteousness to the world. And what 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 the world should be looking at is. All, all of a sudden, you got these young men, and I mean young men all the way up into their 60s and whatever, are so zealous about preaching and talking about the Lord. That should be, a light bulb should go off, man, on a Saturday, as we always bring up, on a Saturday, right? But the world doesn't think, they th they, we, we are we are deemed crazy, man, all right? We are deemed crazy because of, the, because of this, because of the foolishness of preaching, but it should be a, wake, uh, a sign the times man since all you bible thumpers are so about the bible why you don't why you don't take it take an interest in that like, damn why them young dudes on the bike on the, on the corners we ain't slanging nobody dope we ain't doing nothing illegal or none of that man all right but the world the work the bulk of the world is stupid though man well you got it huh? yeah we're a spectacle we're to the nigga, world nigga, nigga. like that. that's a whole nigga the real spec we've been made a spectacle to the world which is perfectly fine. All right. You see men on a on the corner. Oh, they got dresses on. This is a, 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 a priestly garment. Okay. When we get to the kingdom, this is what men, this is gonna be the kingdom of the kingdom attire. What you got? It's sackcloth right now, which is all good. This in itself right here won't be, but we're gonna have real garments made of real material, man. All right. Perfect, perfected. You see, we got the, the, the true garments right. now that we clothed with, which is a which is the scripture. Yeah, Revelation 16. Clothed with the yep. Lord tell you in Revelation, 
Blessed he don't they don't be found naked in that time. Just, keep their garments. They keep their yeah, garments. Revelation. Yeah, man. You. Yeah, yeah, bring it out real fast. You got it. This Revelation 16 and 15. That's it. Behold, I come as a thief. Yep. Blessed is he that watcheth yep. and keepeth his garments, lest he walk naked and they see his shame. Yeah, which shame again represents nakedness. All right. So Adam and Eve wasn't naked in the garden. Not literally. Not literally. Oh, so he hide himself amongst the trees. No, the trees was the people, man. That's parabolically speaking, it's an allegory, man. All right? So that didn't mean he was, they was buck naked. Obviously, the law, you can't be, you can't show your nakedness to no man. So it, it just, Adam didn't know the law, and he just starts being a freak and a garden to eat. No, man. You But you got to have a spirit to be able to rightly divide the word to discern in between, man. Blessed is he that read it, all right? Which is that word read it is anagonoso, which means to divide rightly and in between, man, to discern. All right? Go ahead, brother. This is the back over here just said, though. This is uh, Revelation 14 and 3. And they sung, as it were, a new song yep. before the throne and before the four beasts and the elders. And no man could learn that song but the 144,000. Now, no man can learn that song because we have piped in them, but they're not dancing, right? We know the song, but they off rhythm like this guy. You off rhythm, my man. You don't even know. We could have, I was about to tell him the forefather of Islam, Lord Edomite, the forefather, <laughs> like he was standing, you know? But no, they don't know that song. Give me 1 Corinthians 4, 14 and 7, all right? They don't, they can't understand the distinctions in the song. How can you know what's piped if you don't know what's being played, man? Give me 1 Corinthians 14. And seven. Nation Islam is some Edomite shit. Man. There's some Edomites. All right. All these all doctrines. Okay, and, and these are these idolatry, I, 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 uh, adulterous cults that our people are a part of and in. They come from the heathen, man. All right. Don't matter what heathen they are, damn heathens. Okay. It's not of the Bible or the scriptures. You know. Go ahead. Huh. It's just saying make sure make a distinction in the sound. Got it. Whether the Bible give a song. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. This is uh first Corinthians 14 and 7. It says, and even things without life yeah. given sound. Right. This is a thing that's seeming without life, but it's given sound. All right, because it has life. But you gotta know the Lord gotta been a what called and chose you for the understand and have it, man. Okay, go ahead. It says, and even things without life giving sound, whether pipe or harp. Yeah. Except they give a distinction in the sound. And this I've given a distinction in the sound. That's why the men who's going to hear this and dance to it, the light, they, it's, it have a distinction to it. Men have got with the program, start to what? Uh, renew their minds, right? Start to do the dietary law and start to understand, okay, now that I know what I know, it's time for me to come out and teach. We're, we're vengeance. I mean, we're husbandmen in the vengeance. Uh, all right? The Lord labor of uh, Harvest is plenty, but the labor is a few. Once you learn you're an Israelite and what you're supposed to be doing, it's time for you to teach other Israelites, man. All right? It don't just stop where, oh, I know I'm an Israelite. I ain't supposed to eat pork. Da, 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 and then you just cool. Nah, man. That's, it's, it's, it's further, man. There's more to do. Go ahead. It says, give a distinction in sounds. How should it be known what is piped or harp? Yep, go ahead. Verse 8. It says, for if the trumpet give an uncertain sound, who should prepare himself to the battle? Right. So if we out here telling you, man, you could go eat pork, you could go do this. How can we get our people ready to be delivered, man? All right. That battle sound or that noise, that's the trumpets, man. All right. When you look at that trump, them trumps are troubles, man. Okay. When you play a, 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 a trumpet, shalom, man. When you play a trumpet in the ancient time, it gave off a time of, of what year it is or what was happening. You know, it may be a feast, a high holy day, or something, so you knew the distinctions in it. So when certain things were played, you know how to move towards it, man. Right now, all these people are just damn dumb dogs, man. All right? Go ahead, brother, and share more. Uh, verse, uh, verse 9, it says, So likewise ye, except ye, uttered by the tongue words, easy to be understood. How shall it be known what is spoken? For ye shall speak unto the air. Yeah, so the ones that can speak, that's speaking of, of the thing, not of the most high. You're speaking it to the air, man. But we're speaking it to the souls that have been called to retain this and to the come into the Lord, man. All right. 
That's why we pray that the whole field elect get it. They wonder why we preach selfish. We preach that the elect may get it. Because once they sell, the income. So what you want us to do? It's of the Lord anyways. Jake like, oh no, see, that's why y'all ain't getting everybody. Y'all cursing. He's talking too loud. He's too aggressive. He's too low. Nothing is good for Jake, man. That's why the Lord like, look, don't take an ad out of my word. Just tell him my word. Preach and teach my word. If they don't get it, they don't get it. It wasn't given unto them. All right, go ahead, brother. Fucking to say, these niggas want to stay here forever. And they know, they know that if if we had to wake up every inch of life, we'd never get out of here. We'd never get out of here. So that's why their doctrine is all about saving everybody, bringing everybody together. Once you teach the truth, which is that the Lord's only dealing with the elect, the Lord's only going to seal the elect, and then destroy this place, that puts a fire on you. Like, okay, we don't have to save everybody. We don't have to make everybody get it. If the Lord's going to make, he already has his elect chosen. Right. That's why Paul said in Galatians, have I become your enemy because I tell you the truth? Well, I'm, I'm just telling you the truth. Right? But you bucking up. We're trying to tell you the truth, my man. If he knew that this, his uh, heavenly life was contingent upon this, he would have stayed in and read. He would have done to try to read every word out of the Bible, man. No, seriously. When it's coming, because it's not coming from us. It's coming from the word of the Lord. But Jake looking at it like, man, that's you telling me that, man. Okay, then. All right. Have it your way, then. We're going to see in the end. Okay? That's more. Yeah, that's that's number, one with, number one problem with you Negro, Latino, and Native Americans. Preferably is pride, man. Uh -huh. Ego. You yeah. don't want another. You don't want another man with with the brown skin as you, with with the same, the same nationality as you. Or well, look younger than you. Cause see that really a lot of you niggas are still getting whipped by that uh that Willie Lynch letter, man. Said set against the old against the young, the young against the old, the light skin against the dark skin. You niggas are still getting beat down with that in your minds, man. So that's why you you you're predicated and driven on pride, man. And so don't, don't put your woman out here. A nigga really can't. He ain't gonna. He gonna show his ass, man. Yeah. He, gonna, he gonna show his real naked ass, man. To make it to make it seem as if he knows something. He's not wrong. Oh, I don't know that. That's all you gotta say. I don't know. That's all you gotta say. You gotta show me that in the Bible. Yeah. But it's too much pride, though, man. That's why number one reason, number one, number three reason why niggas died because of pride, man. Ego. It's a hell of a drug, man. See? And now that the... Hold on, hold on. We better, we better change that. We just about to change that. We about to change that. It's hot. Yeah. See the thing? I'm going to put the battery on it right now. because. That's what it's showing. The battery. This watch a battery so we can charge it up. Hey, go ahead. It's on. It's on now. All right. That's the logic for that uh, brief and the Technical difficult. Me and those Satan got to do his thing. All is good. You know, but we're going to still continue, man. Right on what you got. You got to say yeah, that. I got a precept. Yeah, I got a precept. Yeah. All right. Uh, Colossians chapter uh, 2 and verse 8. It said, beware lest any man spoil you. Yeah. Through philosophy and yeah. vain deceit after the tradition of men right. and after the uh, rudiments of the world and not after the Hamasiah. Yeah. So we already just seen a while ago how this man came up here. You know, he get taught to and fro because he had did that with that colonial plantation gospel. Also, white man Jesus, the way he was raised up. You know, he's thinking that you know, everyone can be saved. You know what I'm saying? The Lord love everyone. You tell out here, you don't know who we are, you don't know who the true power is. You know what I'm saying? He don't even know what time that we live in. You know what I'm saying? The signs of the times. So he totally destroyed. He 
You got it. Yeah. Not only do our people not know, they're not willing to learn either. And that's why the law, like, I'm going to destroy you, man. That's good. Just, it's better if I kill you. Right? Because when I restart you, you're going to have, you're going to know everything. The law's going to be in your inward parts. You're good, my man. Yeah. Once the law kills you, the law, like, man, you good with me. They don't get up there and you are Israel, you're going to punish you more. That's right? The punishment. the punishment is the death. When you get up there, this is why I killed The Lord going to tell you why he killed you. And I speak as a man, but obviously it is what it is, right? right. The Lord going to be like, this is why you died, my man. All right? We all must appear before the judgment seat of the Most High. So when you get up there, obviously the Lord, this is your judgment, man, which we started out with. All right? That judgment, man. That's it. You know? We good? We running? Yeah, you go ahead. Come. Got something? Yeah, no. Still on that correction. You could, you could change that. Go back to that government. Yeah, go ahead. All right. Yeah, man. Like, the Lord is mercy and do it forever. But I don't know how long our people is going to basically. The Lord said, My hand is stretched to a disobedient and gainsaying people, man. That's right. You just disobedient, just rebellious, man. All right. Our people, which that word rebel means to war against our Lord. There's no reason to war against our Lord. This is what we need to retain righteousness. And when, we, when you get the righteousness, this would hold the key to salvation. Now, I know the Lord have put himself into a book, all right, and it's to these world, that's foolish. Why would the Lord put himself into a book? Well, that's what the Lord wanted to do. When you go into that word foolish, it means secret. When you go into the root word, all right, so the secrets of the world have these people like this, man. You see? And they don't understand that it's secret. Give me first uh, Corinthians 4 and 6. Four. Yeah, 4 and 6. It say, if our gospel be here, it's here. Second Corinthians. All right? If our gospel be here, it's here to them that are lost. Go ahead. That's because the foolishness of the most high is stronger than the wisdom of the world. Again, the wisdom of this world. That's right. Yeah. He's and not even wise according to this world. He's not. Yeah, he, he in that and when there. you read Job 32 and 8 in that next scripture, said, great men are not always wise, neither do the aged understand judgment. So it don't matter if you old. All right? You could be old or old dummy. All right? You got a lot of old dummies. Right? That was a prime example. Because if you really don't know this, you don't know anything. According to the law, you don't know it. You can know things of the world. You can know how to work a job at the plantation. Nothing matters to the Lord but this. Once people understand that, man. All right? Let me eat. Go ahead, Rock. Back on judgment. This is a. Go, go. Let him get this. Second Corinthians. This is on Second Corinthians. Seven and six. Oh, four and six. Five. Eight. This is our second Corinthians 4 and 3. It says, But if our gospel be hid, yeah. it is hid to them that are lost. Right. So that loss means what? Set to die, to be killed. Right. Sign up for that, man, when you go on that word. So if the Lord hides this from you, it's going to kill you. Yeah. All right? The Lord ain't hide this so he can save you. The ones he wanted to save, he revealed it unto them. What did he say? Uh, his word is revealed unto babes. Get that out. Go ahead, This is uh, again 2 Corinthians 4 and 3. It says, But if our gospel be hid, yeah. it is hid to them that are lost. And gospel, when you go into that, that means good tidings. All right? When you go to Proverbs, I think 25 and 25, it says, uh, This is uh, good news to the thirsty. All right? This is cold water unto the thirsty soul. All right, so the gospel is the good tidings. The good tidings is the word of the Lord that we're bringing unto the world. Okay? Wait, I... Verse 4, it says, In whom the power of this world has blinded the minds of them which believe not. So it blinded the minds of them that believe not. The power. Okay, so the power of this world, right? Huh. Which that, that's Satan. And those Satan vices, all right, those ideologies. Okay, the, 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 the prince of this world, okay, have blinded the minds. The Lord have gave it, given you over to Satan. Get that in Timothy. It says that they, they, they may recover themselves out of the snout of the devil, but they're not going to repent. Okay, it's our second. 
I said the second. Five and maybe the last verse. Twenty to it. Let them recover yeah, just, themselves just out of the snare of the devil. If they repent, to come there back to repentance is the first and foremost feel sorry for what you did and then act on what you're repenting for and don't do it anymore. The Lord always requires action. The Lord is not bump bump lip service. You can't come up there and talk more about the Lord. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm about this. I'm this. No, the Lord requires action. Okay, it sounds good, all right, but until you start getting action behind you, that's when the Lord going to start judging the matter. Go ahead. You can start at 25, 20, 25. It's 2 uh, Timothy 2 and 25. It says, in meekness, instructing those that oppose themselves. Yeah, these, these are the men of people that oppose themselves. Really, whoever not doing the work of the Lord or don't believe the owner men of the Lord, they're opposing themselves. Go ahead. It says, if the Most High, her adventure will give them. Say if. If the Lord, pre-adventure means to say if or would if. All right, go ahead. If the Most High, pure adventure, will give them repentance to the acknowledging of the truth. So give them repentance until the acknowledging of the truth. But you have to acknowledge, all right? The Lord say, only if thou would acknowledge thy iniquities. All right, and what? Repent. Oh, backsliding children. These people backslide. And then they don't even want to acknowledge they backslide. They go deep into what they are. And, and most of these people, we know more about their cultures than them. We can teach them the history of what they in. He don't know what the word Quran means. Quran just a recite or uh, offspring of the Bible. It means to recite. It's reciting scriptures in its own rights, man. That has nothing to do with the word of the Lord, man. All right? Go ahead, brother. Verse 26. You like that topic about the Christian situation. Which, the original Christians were who? Israelites. Jakes. Jakes. Right? Starting with the... Starting up there with the, the, the council of that seat. Yep. Them niggas put all the remixes to the scriptures, man. Yep. Them niggas that sit there that was trying to gain control of their homeland because them fucking Arabs and the, and the mother, uh, who the those Arabs and uh, Ishmael and them, and them really the, uh, what the Ottoman, who are them Ishmael? Yeah, they them too. Eat them, yeah, the Ottoman Turks running shit, man. You came up, you came with. All, well, really, the, the, the religion of Islam to try to gain control back of the land, man. And then you niggas went to fighting and warring and with those, those Ishmaelites. And then ultimately, you niggas turned on each other, as you always do. As they always do. As you always do. You niggas can't, niggas can't do nothing with each other. You can't sell dope with each other. You can't go into business with each other. You can't even, you can't even, you niggas can't do shit. That's because of the curse is on you niggas. Right? And all that, and all that happens, the Muhammad, right along with the other goddamn character, Muhammad, them niggas started, them niggas started laying that sword on your ass, man. And then what happened? He started to what? Really push Islam. He started off as a, a, a control tactic to, to gain control, to bamboozle those Arabs, but they started to believe that shit, man. They started to believe that shit. We talking about a taxi driver, right? Camel jockey, man. Now you niggas go, you, you go down there to your local adult daycare, which I call prison. That's all it is, adult daycare. You get down there with them booty warriors, and you niggas get in line, man. All right? You get with Raza, Muhammad, Mashi, Talabaz, Muhammad, Badur. You niggas get with him up there in the cell. Hey, brother, you got to get down with the program. You niggas get down with the program because you're scared. All right? You see them, you see them air, them air, the air nation motherfuckers over there. You see, it's, it's a call over there. And then you see them other niggas over here on the end. You gotta get with them niggas, man. You know? If you don't want to be a prey, Islam is a jailhouse doctor, man. This is this, this straight up. And them, and them niggas don't know a damn thing. We didn't sit up here and cut up a bunch of them out here in their own, in their own shit. You, will you tell me? Will you tell me, brother? You pose the question. You answer the question, then you pull something back at me. You tell me. Nigga, it's crazy, man. And Islam don't have nothing to, I'm talking about nothing to do with you niggas, man. Uh, uh, really, the only thing you had to do is you get an interjection on this, man. They don't, even, they don't even know what Islam means. The nothing. word. 
No. Nobody knows what no words mean. A lot of people just be out here babbling. You don't know what words mean. All right? They don't hear. I guarantee you didn't know what Islam meant. Nope. Or Judaism. Or Christian. Christian. He been in prison. He been in prison here in the South Carolina shit. He done in South Carolina in jail. Them Geechee niggas, man. Okay. Talking that Geechee bullshit. All right, I know you niggas, man. You niggas from South Carolina, North Carolina, besides the prison. You niggas are some high time coons, man. You take cooning, you are the Michael Jordans of cooning, man. All right, you take cooning to all time hot. All right. There you go. I come back with a fist. He fist, fist bumped everybody, man. What's your name? Like, I'm fucking with the guy, but hey, man, you know, Jake, Jake's simple, though, man. Let's get into these scriptures, though. Let's get into facts. Because he, he said he was dealing with facts. He ain't pulling out one fact. Or nothing, out there. Not one single solitary thing, man. But even when we talk, it don't even matter. We're talking totally wrong language, man. Wait, huh? This is our Jeremiah 31 and 22. It says, for my people is foolish. Look, Jeremiah 17 and 14. Hey, our people are really just discontinued, man. This is, uh, again, Jeremiah 4 and 22. For my people is foolish. His people meaning the Israelites. All right? The Lord, eyes and ears have been perpetually in the house of Israel. According to 2 Chronicles 7 and 14, man. The Lord, eyes is towards his people, man. All right? Go ahead, brother. They have not known me. They have what? They have not known me. What the Lord mean by... His people don't know him. They don't know his name. They don't know what he, he uh require of them, right? They don't know the scriptures and their laws, their statutes. They don't know their forefathers. They haven't searched their forefathers up. This is how you get to know the Lord, man. All right? Go ahead, brother. It says, they have not known me. They are sodish children. They're sodish. When you're growing up, we're sodish. It means stupefied. All right? The Lord called these people so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, the people he have chosen, he said they stupid people. The law said that. And if any pastor got an issue with it, they tell him step right up. All right? And the Lord be glad to, to defend what he said, man, with other scriptures. Calling them ignorant and stupid in other scriptures, man. Stiff that. Go ahead, brother. It says they are sodish children. They sodish. And they have none understanding. They don't have understanding. Okay? Because they haven't allowed this understanding to seep in. If you don't have this, you don't know anything, man. You don't know anything. You got top-notch scholars. These different places. You got the uh the, the guy who for 30 years. He studied the, the anthropologist. He said, man, I studied it for 30 years. All for nothing. Once we went in the scriptures with him, he like, damn, I did all this for nothing, man. Yeah, because that's not true, man. The Lord only deal with uh, uh, wisdom and knowledge, man. According to the scriptures, man. Go ahead, brother. Come on. They have none understanding. Yeah. They are wise to do evil. They are wise to do what? Evil. What? Wise to do evil. And even in evil, they can't get along with that. Nigga cut through each other, right? They go to uh, uh, hit or uh, run right. at the bank. One arm is four, three and four ways. The one, the two in the back, shoot them in the back of the head, and eyes down on them two. Yeah. All for the money, man. All right, they put up, they put a, a wicked scheme together better than, better than the scheme be so good they are with themselves, man. They so wicked, man. Go ahead, brother. They'll get away. The scheme so good and evil, so they'll get away and get caught. Yeah, That's how good the scheme was, man. Yeah, New York. Hey, act them niggas. Hey, act them niggas uptown. Ask them niggas uptown how to rob a dice game. Them niggas tell you oh, forty five ways yeah. how to rob a dice game. Yeah. 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 Expert. Expert. <laughs> I know some partners up there. Them niggas tell you, throw the version over here, and then talk, and come around the corner and rob shit. Yeah, niggas did. do all type of shit, man. They these have surpassed the these of the wicked. Yeah, ask them how to commit adultery. Yeah, nigga, I'm talking about nigga, oh, yeah. nigga have a whole Mission Impossible scheme. Yeah. Coming from the ceiling. <laughs> Never take up the ground for the hook, man. Yeah. Come out the attic every night. <laughs> nigga, sit down. Tell them how to ask them how to yeah. kill a nigga. Yeah. Y'all lay in the bushes all night with a bitch. You know what I mean? <laughs> Look. I cut the lights off. Nigga cut the, nigga cut the lights off. They've been sleeping out of the house. For yeah. Two days, man. Yeah. They love it here. They get ready to die here. So they, huh? they play yourself. These niggas up to my all the top. But like I said, they learn from the best. They learn from the so called white man. That's it. You they niggas up to my when it comes to being them. wicked, you niggas, you niggas take the cake. Yes. In wickedness, man. Give me 12 and 12 and 10. 
Who got something? Yeah. You holding something? Yeah. You can hold that down. Go ahead. Give me that toe. He got more than that. He got more than that. He got more. Go ahead. Give me the toe. Hold that toe. Uh, they have none understanding. Yeah. They are wise to do evil. Yeah. But to do good, they have no knowledge. Right. Yeah, he said, right. wise to do evil. Yeah, nigga, soldiers, let me tell you, man. I leave a nigga, I leave the rag in the back of the car. Yeah. I left the soldier rag on the, in the well, truck. you can see it. So the nigga can see it. Like, that was me. That was my work. Come on, man. Yeah. Nigga, look, nigga, look at the other man. nigga uh, tearing gangster wheels. This nigga was robbing all, he was scum. He nigga robbing all his partners, man. Yeah, I want to see my partner put his money over there in the thing. And he go over there, man. Yeah. Shooting the air for no reason. Everybody run off. He go, he go rob his own partner. He go rob his partner. Man, bitch, somebody hit me up. Let's go. You ever seen a nigga? Nigga did me that because I was little. Nigga stole my shit and helped me look for it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, bring the flashlight over here. We gonna find this son. Ain't never found it. Cause you got it, man. You got it. This is a nigga for you though, man. Nigga, that's that's what a nigga do, man. Nigga, nigga. Hey, man. Like my grandpa. And even when it comes to that adultery shit, man. My grandpa said, don't ever have a nigga around your woman, your mom, or your sister. That's right. Cause nigga blow a ride, nigga not, not a ride in any one of them. Car blow a ride, nigga put a ride in your mama or all your sister, man. That's right. Yeah, nigga's wicked, man. Damn, bitch, your mama's fine. Don't play with me. Nigga's wild, man. Yeah, that's just what you do, man. Nigga in the truth. Huh? Nigga in the truth. Yeah, Mother Tall said that, man. Hey man, a lot of these guys, a lot of these guys ain't ain't for the long haul. Don't have to be yeah, yeah. around your woman, man. Yeah. Make sure your, your when, when a guy come by your house, yeah. make sure your woman somewhere far gone, man. Yeah. The Jake ain't Jake ain't right, man. How you doing, sister? Then he checking her out though, man. Shalom, shalom family. You gotta watch the niggas that say shalom. You know, some of the worst niggas, man. <laughs> nigga be in your woman, man. Nigga know when you're going to work and everything. Come over there. I'm looking, I'm looking for, I'm looking for, I'm a wide. No, no, I'm a wide going to work. Yeah. How you doing today, sister? You like some edification? Yeah. yeah. Uh, fucking bullshit, man. Like, What's it? You, you keep, you keep them two, you keep them two worlds separate, man. Yeah, you niggas all out of order. Niggas all out of order. Yes, indeed, look. Stay out of order. Hey, when I was coming up, man, a dude, <laughs> and the truth, we called him the Seattle Snake, man. He, he went from, man, they were then in three camps. I think committed adultery, man. Yeah. The Lord got his ass, man. Yeah. He went out there. To, he went out there to California. He was standing on the on the stand on the on the uh what do you call that damn thing? The balcony, man. Yeah, balcony. The Lord had a strong wind come through, and he, and he yeah, fell five stories down, man. Yeah, we don't take your ass out. Yeah, yeah, man. The Lord make him suffer for the ticket. Slow down. That's a wicked man. That's it. These niggas out here, these niggas out here, they can't help this stuff. Here you go, man. These niggas all great. You be walking with, with your woman, holding hands with her. The nigga try to holler at it out here, man. We got a bunch Look. of uh, drops out here, drops. Yeah. <laughs> niggas out here, they gotta, man. They got a few. They're trying to holler at your woman with you holding her hands, man. You, you, you won't either, either be dead or in the prison with these niggas out here. Most of these niggas down here, he, he take them and take him, man. And just throw them on in the yeah. spot. Buy them on up, man. Get you know? on out of here. What up, what up, what up, what up? <laughs> All right, go ahead, bro. Our people wicked. You got that? We have passed the D's of the wicked. Our people. Yeah. Okay, they, 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 scumbags, they, man. They beyond. Right. Then, then the men, they like, they like women too. You could be all making money. It's just you ain't the main guy, and, and you is. You still eating. I'm still, you my poor. I'm still giving you down there seventy five percent of what I'm getting. But what a nigga do? Nigga want to be you. They would do anything to, to, to kill you, and then you left with nothing. You don't know the backstory, you don't know the scheme, how, how, how it's all operated, nothing. But it's just because you don't have it. Hurry, nigga, I'm telling you that. I want to kill a nigga because I just don't want him to have it. Damn. Real quick. Them niggas uptown, them niggas up, you go about 12, 15 blocks that way. Yeah. Them some of the worst niggas here, man. Damn. Them niggas uptown. Cutthroat to the bone crystal. And then, like I said, what's made it worse, these young boys, these young boys, they don't they don't play by no rules, man. You like you remember back in the day, bro, I, if you with your daughter or your son, nigga won't kill you. Shit, today, nigga step on you, your daughter, and everybody else with it, man. 
This is uh, Jeremiah 5 and 26. It says, for you want straight to the point? Yeah. This is Jeremiah 5 and 28. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yet they overpass the deeds of the wicked. So they wax and they shine in it, man. If you see a Jake, a Jake, a Jake Mo, we don't call him a Mo, so the, the, the screen don't get, you know, hit. A Mo is one of them boys, the right from switch hitters. You'll see a Jake, he had a whole get up on him. Nails, makeup, yeah, hair, that? heels, a dress. Then you'll see, you'll see an Edomite, he just have a pink shirt on with some open toe sandals, man. Open toe slippers. Well, it was sad though, too. It'd be I simple. You got the women doing it. You got the women want to be in competition with the uh, with the uh, the transformers getting yeah. the, getting the, the hydro gel asses, titties, lips done. You in competition with the with yeah. the switch hitters, man. Switch hitters. They was known for doing that, man. Yeah. Now you got the women doing it. You putting you and you can't tell a woman shit. But you got them cumbra. They really is called cumbrellas, man. Because the woman in France was over there giving Scully out, man, and men were injecting on her face. She so she don't get it in her eyes. She had them, she had them, them big ass eyelashes on, man. 
But you tell your women about that shit, y'all don't all know that that's not true. But that's the way that's why they won't wear it. So you could yeah. do that to the tongue, man. Yeah. What? Yeah. Yeah, but a lot of, a lot of them women they, they, they want they want they want that man juice though, man. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put it in. Let me be bald and you know, whatever. Hey man, hey, fuck it, man. We, yeah. It's to the point you get straight direct with this yeah. shit, man. Yeah. It is what it is, man. The world direct. Yeah, we gotta deal with it, huh? Yeah, you're right. Yeah. We gotta deal with all these wicked ways and evilness. We gotta walk around this. We gotta do it vexes. We still gotta be around it, man. We can't we can't kill nobody, right? So we, what can we do? We can't do nothing. So it vex our souls. This is all we really can do. It's been out. This the way we feel, man. Sign crime, man. I, all we can do is sign crime, man. For the abominations that's done now, and man, they countless amount of. We we talk about abominations. We're being the king. But we gonna keep on talking and we never end it, man. That's it. Yup, that's why I said they done sent our enemies to their own life, man. Right? No peace night. Ain't no rest for them, boy. This is our still Jeremiah 5 and 28. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. They done surpass these people on this sign, they surpass the heathens, man. All right, wickedness. The heathens show them how to do something wickedly, and they outshine them. Yeah, yeah. But we gonna show y'all how to do this, man. Yeah. And that's why when people gotta kill majority, the Lord gonna kill majority of these people. You got yeah, well, when niggas, when niggas go to try to sell that dough, the first thing a nigga go do is go put that 20 Montana pick the, the yeah. post on the wall. He, he trying to, to go surpass in. him, man. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> niggas, niggas crazy. He about to go in. They gonna go, they gonna go get that, they gonna get the 20 Montana, or they gonna get the, the Trinity, man. Go to 20 Montana. They go get El Chapo, they go get uh, Escobar. They tell me to sell it. Nigga, you want it? They have you niggas down here. You want to get in the corner of a, not even a, 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 a corner of the goddamn uh, brick, man. And going ready to go do fan time. All right? What that one dude I told you about? Bucktown. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This nigga, this nigga selling dope out the goddamn the, uh, oh, the corner, man. Weapon. The yeah, man, man. Yeah. Yeah. He's had a big dope. Big old dope. Uh, <laughs> then it, then it, then it, then it, then it, the nigga hold uh, man wire for years. For years. This nigga, yeah, this nigga yeah. every other month, he gonna make a trip to to, to, uh, to Houston. And the mortuary. Yeah, he, he go, they go get uh, uh, this much, this much, and he's stretching his shit. Stretching yeah, his shit. Hurt, but, not, but now you, right. now you doing fed time forever. This nigga's is crazy, man. The black man in America is so deep up all, man. Yeah. I'm serious. It don't make it don't make sense, man. Niggas be hustling backwards. Yeah, and you to use some of the most vile niggas. Niggas, I man, I just, I've been running niggas as niggas still dope to their mothers, man. To their uncles, to their to their father, brother. And don't feel no way about it. They are I ran a buy from me, bitch, and then buy from another nigga, and now that nigga gonna fuck over. Nigga, you killing me. You killing me. Crazy it. niggas, man. Stupid niggas, man. Oh. Oh. These like a rock chapter. Yeah. Nigga, listen to that shit. Yeah. Nigga, say that shit, brother. Nigga, say that shit. Nigga, sick, man. Catch on fire, Jake arrive your grandma coming out late night car jagger, then drag her through the car and she holding on to it. These these the mistress monsters is 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 unmerciful, man. Nigga used to give back in the day, nigga used to give you a pass with the children. For real? They ain't give you no pass. Oh, uh, grandma and them outside, man, put all that shit up. We ain't gonna sell no dope. We're gonna hide the guns. Like nah, man, nah, it's, I'm stepping on your grandma. And great, and great granny, Annie. They just had two uh uh old ladies get shot. With that video you sent on um, through the house yeah. Yeah, in the seven walk. That's a well known thing for you. Shot a 70 year old. You niggas always killing cars and mailboxes, man. Pepper Pigs. 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 Pepper Pigs.
righteous cut off. Where was the righteous cut off? Go. Ain't nobody innocent, man. Go ahead, huh? y'all got something? Go ahead. This is uh, Jeremiah 5 and 28. I'm going to read the 29. You got read the 29. You read the 29. Yes, you got some too. You got, you got some Judah? Yes, sir. This is uh, Jeremiah 5 and 28. They are waxing fat. They shine, yet they overpass yeah, deeds of the wicked. Yeah, we read that one. God, they judge not the cause of the fatherless. They judge not the cause of the fathers. All right? Who are the fathers? First and foremost, it's these people, man. All right? They're without a father. Here, most men are physically without a father, and the Lord have turned out the, his face from the mass majority of the nation of people, man. All right? They're without the, spirit, the heavenly father. The Lord is not with them. And the Lord ain't with you, he's against you on this side. All right? Go ahead. It says, the cause of the fatherless, yet they prosper. In the right of the needy, do they not judge? They don't judge the right of the needy. Right? Because Jacob come and rob one of us, his neighbor. He know all we got is a couple hundred dollars for bills. But you don't rob us. But here you got Arabs at the, at the store that, that take out $200,000 every two days. You wouldn't go rob them, though. But they in the hood, though. They let, they let Becca drive. They let Becca run through the hood. Yup, Becca run through the hood. Oh, the right insurance there. man. Y'all can not <laughs> with the briefcase going to the house to house just collecting money. I ain't about to rob him. That's the feds, bro. Yeah. Wait a minute. He got $30,000 on us that he taking from the poor. But they let him pass. You ain't going to. Our people is not going to go to these other nations. And all the other nations got all the money. They're going to rob their people there in the hood with knowing that man going to walk with you behind that. They have no mercy, man. Especially on the knee. Then that black woman just go through and get in tune with you. They go lie to her brothers and her uncles and have y'all warring the whole yep. goddamn summer behind some bullshit. Yep. She got a feeling hurt. Oh, she got in a conversation. She shouldn't even been in, man. See, the women are really though. The women, the women are really the reason why a lot of shit be happening, man. Yes, killing this shit. The root of matter. Damn. Girl, see, they're the most, they're, they're loving on the most dangerous shit there is, man. When it comes to messing bullshit. Oh, yeah, she gonna go lie, man. That nigga hit me. He called me a bitch. He did me this. But you was the one running the egg in the ass, man. And my mother told you to go about a business. He turned all loose up. See, bitch, I don't play behind that. You heard me? You're going to die behind that. Who gives a fan? You know, niggas crazy, man. I'm a bank. Sister, crazy, man. Longest, longest two left shoes. But come in there and act like you just did respect to everyone. But she came, butted in, ain't cursed us all up. He come out there, which one of y'all playing with my sister? Why you gonna get put to death? You and your yeah. sister. Yeah, man. Y'all gonna put both y'all together. It's better you already know how she is. Like, I got, I got people in my family that done that shit. Yeah, he did it. Like, what I, you already, I already know that motherfucker. I'm reasonable. Yeah. She's wild, loud, yeah. crazy as hell. Then you go catch the dude, hey, bro, what, what happened with that shit? You hear the other side of the story, like, all right. Yeah, bro, just leave it alone. She throw it off, bro. Don't even worry about that shit. Yeah, that's all it takes. You got to really, you, to this point, you got to find, you gotta find the truth. I mean, the, the truth, you got to listen to both sides. You can't be taking that, taking that shit in, man. You can't, be, you can't really be listening to that shit, man. Go ahead, I. Verse 29. It says, shall I not visit for these things? Said the Lord. Yeah, the Lord gonna visit for these things. Y'all plan on the need. First and foremost, the real need is the men of the Lord. When y'all do respecting them, the Lord got a controversy with you, man. His little ones. Don't do that to, the Lord don't care about you two thirds on his side. He'll care about y'all in the key. Y'all gotta go play on them niggas. When y'all come start to play with the men of the Lord, y'all got a problem now. That's a problem with the Lord. Go ahead. It says, shall not my soul be avenged on such a nation as this? Yeah, so the Lord's soul going to be avenged on such an unmerciful. He says his, his face is not towards his un This is an untoward generation, man. Adulterous generation, right? That got friendship with the world, do the things of the world in the world, man. And the Lord changed for and forth. I want a Lord got a controversy with this world like this, man. That's why you see judgment so high in like that. The Lord of judgment is, is in the earth every day. All right? Got it. 
Okay, go ahead. Um, Hezekiah. All right, this is uh, Sirach 5 and verse 3. Um, yeah, Sirach 5 and verse 3, it says, And say not, who shall control me for my works? For the Lord will surely revenge thy, thy pride. Verse 4, say not, I have sinned, and what harm have happened unto me? For the Lord is long-suffering, he will in no wise let thee go. So the Lord not going to let, let you go. And tell you with that Sirach, believe 15, that the Lord did give no man license to sin. All right? So the Lord, he have, matter of fact, get that. Get Sirach 15, start at like 9. All right? The Lord said he have no need of a sinful man. You can't just go out there and sin what the Lord got me. The Lord uh, do everything. No. You did that upon your lust according to James, man. And after that lust, after sin that came forth, after that bringing forth death, man. Jake is killing himself. He that sinned is an enemy to his own life. It came back around. All right? Go ahead, brother. All right. This is uh, the book of Ecclesiastes, 15 and 9. Praise is not seemly in the mouth of a sinner. Yeah, start at the point. He left time. My bad. This is uh, Sirach 15 and 11. It says, Say not thou, it is through the Lord that I fell away. Don't say cause it's because of the Lord you fell away, man. And, and the Lord going to tell you why. Don't use him as an excuse or why you doing something evil or wicked. Go ahead. It says, for thou oughtest not to do the things that he hated. So don't do the things he hates. The Lord said he's angry with the wicked every day. All right? And he has no pleasure in the sinner. Go ahead, huh? Say not thou, he hath caused me to err. Yeah, the Lord ain't caused you to err. All right? Yes, the Lord control all things. All right? And you just read, who shall control me for my works? Right? Go ahead, brother. For he has no need of a sinful man. The Lord don't need a sinful man. He created Esau for that. The Lord created Esau to sin. Just do his thing. He's a man of sin. He's the man of perdition. He's the man of sin. All right? That's who the Lord created him for. So he's talking to what? Israelites right here, man. I don't, that's no need for me to have you as a sinful man to go off. Right. Jake is going off beyond his lust, man. Got that in James? Go ahead. One. This is, uh, again, Ecclesiastes 15 12. and 12. Say not thou, he hath caused me to err, for he has no need of a sinful man. The Lord hated all abominations. Oh, yeah, he hated what? He hated all abominations. The Lord hated all abominations and what? And they that fear the most high love it not. So we got a problem with the abomination that's out here too. The men that fear the Lord got a problem. We got a saying down here in GMS New Orleans. We pay whatever the Lord with, we with. If the Lord hated, it, we hate it. The Lord said, I hate them that hate thee with a perfect hatred. So we hate them with a perfect hatred. We hate everything the Lord hates, and we love everything the Lord loves. So you yeah, we must it. basically hate. Hate the evil and love the good. And love man. the good. All right, so anything that's centered around righteousness and right and good, we we, we all for it, man. But well, we can just man for that shit, man. Okay, it's, it's plain. Let me say something too. A lot of you, Jake, you got conscience enough to know well, that's one thing the Lord did instill in us, man. Our conscience of the little right from wrong, man. Yes. You know, you know going fuck with another man, woman ain't right, man. You know, putting them goddamn pipes. And popping pills is wrong too. Which you put, which the Lord tell you that that shit puts spirits on you, demons on you, man. And according to the Bible, because it wouldn't say that your eyes are the, are the gateway to your soul. Yeah, too, so. so you need to be all glazed over, high. But you have a conscious moment not to do that shit. Yeah. Selling dope, you know that not, you know that shit ain't right. Right. But the Lord come to come to you as a witch. He said, I suffer not a witch to live. I Meaning he, he's gonna kill any nigga that's into that former kill. Wipes out, it's gonna kill you. Yeah. Right, cause all you are, we, tell, we don't have to sign. Remember, remember the old, old walkering sign used to be that 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 cup, the, the caduceus cup, the, the, not the caduceus, but the little cup with the uh, thing in it that crush the crush the earth. You know, this is all into this is really dealing with the left hand of sorcery, man. Putting casting spells on people, man. You see, you see it with the with the, with the dope piece. Yeah, you go right here. That was the old, the old, uh, the old walk green shit, man. And look at all the stars coming out of there. Uh, 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 tilted like this buff mint, perfectly. It's the saucer. Look at, look at that. That star is tilted. The other star is tilted. 
It's a bottle of mint stars, man. You know? Which, which, both of those deal with what? Medicine, which, which is, you see that, you ever seen that pipe? You got the two snakes going around the pipe, facing yes. opposite ways, goes in, into the, uh, the caduce, which deal with witchcraft, man. Sorcery. Sorcery, man. And what, and what it, what it does, it puts, it puts spells on people, demons on people, man. Yes. They have you out your goddamn mind. Right? Enchantments and shit. And with yeah. the music. And, but they say Jacob is not, there's no enchantment against Jacob. Right. And that yeah. Jacob is talking about the what? The elect of Israel. Because yeah. all of Israel is not of Israel. You ain't going to enchant the men of the Lord. Get the, get the, all right? the then you got Isaiah 47 that speak about the witches yeah. and warlocks, the stalkers and panacecators. Yeah. Yeah. All right? You can't stand. Go look into that sir. And all that it says, your kingdom is numbered and finished. According to Daniel, man. Right. That's why we go into this a lot of times too, man. This is right here. This world, this world itself, preferably you Jakes in that in that black culture world, is is ran by this bafu mint, man. A androgynous demon that has a has a rod in a in a vagina, man. And all your all your sports entertainers, people that they, they worship this, man. In order to keep in order to keep the power and the money they got, they worship this, man. That's why they don't, they don't give a damn about uh, sacrificing their, their sons, their mothers, their daughters, their old ladies. They don't give a damn. They want they want the world, the power of this world, right? Yes, these niggas put up them signs for a reason. I remember back in the day, before the, the height of uh, LeBron James, sorry ass, niggas would just shoot a three pointer and go about their business. Now niggas shoot a three pointer, you throw up the six 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 sign, man, right? You throw up all, all these damn signs, man. You all like this here, all shooting. Yeah. What, what are you doing? What is this, Carmelo? Uh, uh, Westbrook. This yeah, is doing this shit. Three, go back to the ride, man. Yeah. Yeah. They can shoot down and yeah. 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 What you doing, man? And this nigga LeBron, he does a he does a ritual, which originally, yeah, originally yeah, Michael Jordan was doing that ritual, man, yeah. with the with the with the dust and confusion. You pat it. Beat his chest. That's all going back and going into masonry, man. Yeah. The they get you, hands. yeah, they get two people into this shit. Give me that in Amos. That's Amos proper, 6. Proverbs 6. Where they get you people into that shit, man. You start doing it. All that remember the dab? The dab was the dab goes into masonry, man. That blanket shit they had you niggas on a couple of years ago? That's all masonry. And, and it was a uh, uh, and that shit was uh, a torture mechanism for the slaves back then. It's like then they're like almost waterboard. Wait, I, you got it? It's, it's the book of Proverbs, it's chapter song, 6. Right it's Proverbs, chapter 6, verse 13. Wow. Wait, wait, I'm going to start at 12. A naughty person, a wicked man, knocketh with a forward mouth. Yeah, and that's the, that's that's the, the book of these people. Society. That's the secret society, yeah. man. The book of these people in society. Yeah. And it's really, it's, it's, I'm gonna say this, there's a lot of them around here. Roughly here in New Orleans, man. Witches, magis, sorcerers, warlocks. They're here. Okay, go ahead. He winketh with his eyes, he speaketh with his feet, he teacheth with his fingers. One more time, let that voice go by. Proverbs 6 and 13. He winketh with his eyes, he speaketh with his feet. Teach it with his fingers. You teach it with his fingers. That you see these signs and symbols that he do, man. All right? You see these niggas putting up the best of Pisces, putting their hands like this? Why? Wow, they, they, they actually, they actually have power and control to keep it, man. Keep sending me my money. You know, I'm down with the cause, man. All right? What else did what else niggas do, huh? Man in the tiger. Yeah, these masons. Yeah, these masons. They do the hidden hand. The hidden hand. They niggas stand like, like this and this, shit. This one. Yeah. And then yeah. this one. Like all this shit. Put your hand. Hey. Remember Max? Remember Max wasn't just doing this because he's that. No, Max was juiced up. Yeah, all them niggas juiced up, man. Martin Luther King, they all juiced up, man. He did the boy. Frederick Douglass. Don't do your research on them niggas. Was masons, man. The so-called founding footballers that came over here was masons. All right. Yorkshire, Sky Right Mason, real, I'm talking about real supreme witches, man. They conjure up all type of demons and shit, man. Marcus Garvey was a Mason. Yeah, Marcus Garvey. 
The nigga plugged in. She was plugged in. She was a she was a, she was a spy, man. A spy. Harry Tubman was a spy. Harry Tubman. Yeah, yeah, who took the, the pictures for the Rosa Parks on the bus? Yeah. Time. Yeah, I'm gonna say this too. That shit was not the Rosa Parks situation was nothing more than a that shit happened over 10 to 15 years before she did. It was a woman, it was a woman that they selected to be the, the first Rosa Parks. They didn't like it because of what? Two things. Her skin color that she was, she was too dark. And she and she ran up fucking around and have a baby at a young age. So they didn't want to fuck with her. She was a single mom, man. Shameful thing back then, and it still is. Yeah, but then they chose Rosa Parks, like the brother said. Who took her pictures of her gazing out the window? window yeah. <laughs> Sitting there in the back. Professionals were tired of her at that time. Yeah. They have cameras, like, talking about it. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah, all this shit, man. How they got that? Like, it's a camera phone picture. Like that. The other picture. Giant. You got the other picture with you got the picture with my, uh, Malcolm uh, Martin King sitting down, depressing in the, in, the, in the jail cell. Yeah. Who the fuck got the picture to do that, man? <laughs> it's all scripted. All right, I'm gonna say this too. The the uh, the N N N A W A C P was a fucking scam. Yeah. It's a it's a it's nothing more than bullshit, man. Like loud matter, same thing. Bullshit scam. I believe them gutter rats came up with the N A W A C P 1805. By 1905, they put a black face to it, man. Yeah. Right? That's why when you go, you go watch uh, Selma. What is it, Selma? Yeah. This nigga marching and shit down in Selma. Yeah. What is all that? Yeah, Selma. They watch on Selma. You start seeing Moses King with what? Gun rats Gun all around him, man. Marching. He got pictures with the watch shop. Yeah. You don't That's take right. pictures with them. Let me get that. I got the. I got, you know, I got to get the famous one. Gosh. Put a nigga, brother. You know, this is the only nigga in history ever said this shit. Yeah. He had a dream, but that dream was a nightmare. I got it. I give my people to a burning ladder. But we don't, again, we don't know the history. All the leaders that set up, all right, they were set up. They set up to keep the minds of the people in the order in which they want them in, man. They got to learn that shit, man. All you actors and celebrities, they set them up to keep the people under the... Under the hypnosis, man. Or what they want under the agenda, man. They, they call you less illuminary. Less illuminary. All right, this is one I got for you. This is Jeremiah chapter 23, verse 23. I'm going to read down. It says, I am mm -hmm. a power at hand, said the Lord, and not a power for all. Can any hide himself, himself in secret places that I cannot, that should not see him, said the Lord. Do not I fill the heavens and earth, said the Lord. And this, everything else is the point. I have heard what the prophet said that prophesied in my name, saying, Martin Luther King. I have a dream. I had I have a dream. I have a dream. And check this out. Question. What precept have you ever heard Martin Luther King say? <laughs> we just being honest. He's a pastor, huh? He's a pastor too. Yeah. What precept have you ever heard from him? Man talk. If you're a pastor of the Lord, you're gonna leave. Even the pastor in the church that they say one of the precepts. I, I don't remember. They don't have nothing on file of Martin Luther King ever using one precept of the Bible. Ever. Right. But he's saying his name. That's why give me Ezekiel 14 and 9. The Lord set these people up. All right. Because he yeah. wanted, it's still a nation of people. He got to have blinded. All right. Keep them blinded. Go ahead. One more line that says, verse 20, 26. How long should this, how long should this be? Yep. In the hearts of the prophets that prophesy lies. Yeah, they are prophets of the seat of their of own what? heart. Of the seat of their own heart. Which again, the Lord set them up. You got it? Let's get it. Which I got it right here. You know what I got, brother. Oh, yeah, if I ever have to bring it out. I got the I got, I got the Jagger Hoover files right here. Where they had they had uh Mother King shit the ball, Yes. And I'm Martin Luther King was fucking with men and I'm everything. Playing at homosexual. Well, most of them up there are homosexuals. Yeah. Way not good. Them niggas is faggots, man. Yeah, Martin Luther King's boyfriend, name was, uh, uh, what his name was? Bernard Rustin. Yeah, Bernard Rustin, man. That was, that was Martin Luther King's boyfriend. Man. Obama was a, what, had a you seen that when I'm putting that to him? Yeah, yeah his, his, Obama boyfriend was named, uh, Larry Sinclair. Nigga, that had men. He was dealing with men. You heard him lot. That nigga said, man, I picked Obama up in the, in the, in the, yeah. he went to, he went to, he went to the Supreme Court with that shit, man. Put some lips on Obama. That nigga said, man. He put lips on him. That nigga said, man, look, I went to pick Obama up in the limousine. We started an eight ball of coke. I gave him a fellatio. Whoa, whoa, hold up. Yeah, he gave him some scully, man. He gave him some face. 
And then you know under the regime of buying for them eight years now, many executive orders that he put in place for these moles that's walking around. Yeah, he the president of that. Of the moles, man. He the one that, that all these L's, all them letters, we can't say it due to restriction rights. But y'all know them to LGBTQ, R, X, Y, Z, M, O, R, all those? Yeah. That came under the regime of your, my president is black, my Lambo blue. <laughs> under him, man. And that nigga African. Go ahead, I. Yeah, yeah, so many people passed up how many times. This nigga didn't call Michelle Michael so many goddamn times. Michael. That's a nigga, man. Michael. That's a nigga, man. That nigga didn't. Them broad ass, stiff ass, wide shoulders. All right? Hands big. Yeah, hands big. You got to grab a meat rebound. You dance one time. You seen that? You seen that bulge, man? You know? That's a nigga. That's a man. That man's meat. That's a nigga, man. That's a nigga. Two, 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 two niggas are so, you so, you so, y'all solid and, and fools are stupid, man. You can't see this shit. Man. You ain't gonna never have a nigga, a, so, a real nigga that be president, man. Ever. Because they're not locked in. You gotta be, like you said, the Bushes and the Trumps, those laws, those laws juiced in under, underneath the elites and shit. Like, you gotta be of the family, man. You got to be related to one of the bankers or something like that, man. A nigga never run for president. Ever. A uh, Mexican never. Ever. Ever. Ezekiel 14 and 9. It says, and if the prophet be deceived. If the prophet be deceived. He just read Jeremiah 23 and 25. If the prophet be deceived. Let's see. If the prophet be deceived, yep. he had spoken a thing. Well, he has spoken a thing. Go ahead. I, the Lord Yahweh, have I, the Lord Yahweh, have what? Deceived that prophet. What? He have what? Have deceived that prophet. The Lord say, I deceived the prophet. The Lord meaning I set him up and let him deceive the people, man. So Martin Luther King was set up through the spirit of the Lord to deceive the people, man. That nigga was fucking with children and everything, man. That nigga was flying on them jets, going to over there to Europe. What the fuck he doing dealing with the Pope, man? I don't know. You know, world, you know how they get down. He Pope, was dealing with the children, man. Pope touching them hard. Man. He was over here on the phone, on wiretap. Uh, uh, what the name is? Uh, What's that dude? Jacob Hoover. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yes, sir. Jacob Hoover Jacob. had him on wiretap, man. All right? In there with... Uh, Lord Russell, Anthony, you talking about bring that big old black thing over here. Bring that big thing over You freaked out, man. That man was a freak. But if you tell our uncles, Martin Luther King with this, and you, you bring fight. out the real, I'm gonna bury you, man. I'm gonna get in that silk, that silk, uh, that silk white beater back in the day and push the lights out. Say what? Martin Luther King was a homosexual. Man, that man gonna bury you, man. That man ain't gonna bury you, man. They don't deal with facts, though. They don't deal with facts, though. You gonna look this up. This is facts. It's all facts, man. But the Lord is deceiving these prophets that set up. He's bringing these it items. up. The Lord brought it up. The Lord brought it up. He's on top of uh, yeah. the Scott King trying to have it sealed yeah. for another 10 years. Yeah, but the Lord brought it up, though, man. Y'all got some news on this, somebody. Yeah, keep doing it. This is Ezekiel chapter 2, verse 3. I got you, man. And he said to me, Son of man, I sent thee to the children of Israel. To a rebellious nation and rebelled against me. Yep. They and their fathers had transgressed against me even to the very day. And that's, and that's why the Lord sent you a, 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 a wicked prophet. Uh, and like you told the pastors, the ones that they believe are honking it to, they shall, uh, the ones that listen to the pastor, the Lord will kill the pastor, and the ones that listen to him, man. The Lord, like, look, since you won't listen to him, uh, 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 Unrighteous man, I'm gonna kill you just for you listening to the unrighteous man, man. All right, that's why a lot of these pastors, uh, the congregation gonna seek their life, like I said, right? The people of the, the church gonna seek their life once they find out they've been lied to for 50 years. They're gonna seek their life, like, damn, man, I gave you all my money, I gave you my life bill, money, my lights was on, all right, and you was lying the whole time, man. All right, that's a judgment for that. Go ahead. Well, that's what, the, the bulk of these churches, all right, throughout America, the bulk of these churches are paid off, man. Yes. All right, they all, they all, they all signed uh, under 
Murphy Law is 513C Charters, man. They have, they have to lie to you on purpose. They lie. would never it's tell real. you who you are. And they get tax exemptions every year by the government. You wonder why you go home from church on a Sunday to your lights off, to, to dealing with the problems in the hood. He just go back to on the North Shore. You got helicopters, you got, they got Bentleys, Rolls Royces they go back to. And they come back, hey, my helicopter. Can we all put, a, put together a thousand dollars, man? What are you doing? Pimps, man, and don't know nothing. Don't know no scriptures, nothing, man. You ask, you ask him a question. Oh, 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 I'm gonna change. Yeah, get him out of here. Score him out. Deal with him real fast. Take y'all to church. Yeah. Hey, back in the day when we first started off, uh, you know, we were rolling up on everything. I remember even at the LA camp, man. They rolled up on the pastor. That boy put him in the waiting room for about a good 20, 30 minutes. Next thing, one of the brothers looked out the window. He he getting rushed in the car. He getting rushed in the car to get out of there. He's getting out of there, man. They don't want to answer no questions, man. They were set up to lie to you. Like, I already know you're going to do some whole shit, man. Nigga in the green right here. Let's go. Then, like I say, you go, you go through the Superman in that window. Through the Superman punch in the window and he says something, man. But go ahead, you know. This, this shit, man, these niggas set up, man. That's when, that's when you first start waking up, Bob. When you start finding out everybody lying. Everybody lying. Everybody lying. The world is, is staged. Yes. Everything is for the whole world is staged. You start to pull the curtains back and peel the layers back yeah, and man. find out everything is fake. Oh, You're going to be like, damn. Everything I learned and knew in life was a lie. Yep. You got to empty everything out. The law like, nah, you got to get rid of that. You can't keep nothing, man. Everything got to go. The whole world is staged, man. I, yeah. It's like that movie, The Truman Show. Like The Truman Show, nothing was real. Right. His wife, the love he had, the job, nothing was real. Nothing. He liked me with the... Even in history. <laughs> even in history. Even in history. Know, <laughs> that you didn't know is all bullshit. Yes. You find out the people that's over the, over the, the education system over here, and nothing, more, and nothing more than the, the Rothschilds and the Rockefellers, man. They control what, what you learn. They're teaching you. You never teach the people that you're about to rule over, man. Ever. You never teach them. What you do is telling them how to serve you. You, you instruct them, right? And that's what they've been doing us in these, in these schools. How to be a slave. Work, go home. Work, go home. Work, go home. Be a good slave. That's what he said. Uh, David Rockefeller said, I don't want a nation of, of thinkers. I want a nation of workers. A slave, right. That's when, that's when the education system was set up. Like I always say, you know, I present it every time. What school? Y'all of y'all been to school? Anybody been to college? Never been with no Jews. From elementary school to college, have you ever seen any Jewish kids in your school? Not one. Where they at? Where they at, where they at though? And like I said, I've been able to go to school down here, where it's mostly predominantly Jake or Judah. I've been able to go to go to Texas and be around all nations. And I ain't seen not one. And it's by the time. They teach them how to rule the world, how to, how to deal yes. with money. Business. Businesses and shit. Come on, yeah. They teach you niggas how to do the when nigga get death, nigga gonna become a rapper, man. How to work, man. How to work. How to entertain, man. How's these niggas are entertainers, man? You know? The black woman get dead, but she gonna she gonna she gonna go be a model. Do some hair. Or sling that ice cream. Or sling that ice cream. Be the one. Model. Yeah. They both sling that ice cream. Taking them clothes off. Some kind of Now you niggas ain't got in the business slinging ice cream. Yeah. Good luck. Now jiggle Swinging that ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 You got some, huh? It's a doc. Oh, oh, man. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah, Galatians niggas, chapter 6 and verse 7. After he finished. He, he said, but. He said, he said, after he finished. He, he said, be not deceived. The Almighty is not mocked. For whosoever a man, what whatsoever a man saw, that shall he also reap. Yes, verse 8. He said, for he that soweth to the flesh, shall of the flesh reap corruption but he that soweth to the spirit shall of the spirit reap everlasting we so reaping, you know like, hey we're reaping <laughs> of the flesh we'll be reaping of the spirit yeah, that's it amazing i'm we'll be reaping we're reaping this truth man we'll that's it the truth. shall reap what you saw hopefully immortality domain that's yeah. it a, 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 a double garment of righteousness a like deity all, all that the pump of the world they're reaping to go out here and run this rat race for what worldly worldly objects man yeah. That's it. Hoping to get something back from the world. They reaping that commodity. Yeah. That's what they're 
that's gonna be their they crowning achievement. Hey, that's the world opus magnum. The that's, yeah. <laughs> that's gonna be their crowning achievement. You can, look at a, you, can, you can look at you can panic him around, man. The bulk of these people out here gonna, gonna get that chip. They, gonna, they, well, they don't have a choice. That's they how you get the market. Where the market beast sign at? Yeah. That's how you they gotta live. live. They're gonna get that market of beast. That's man. how you gonna have to live in society. So they're gonna give everybody two bands and get two it. bands. Two thousand. They did the same thing in the, in the movie, The First Purge. Come take, come, come, put the chip in the, in the first purge is what? Putting them things in your eye. Come down here, we're gonna look out for you, see how long you last, put the things in your eye. And guess what? The black woman, first and foremost, she's gonna get it. Hey, look, I told you, we said it back then. Hey, if you wanna keep this social security, you wanna keep this uh, food stamp, section A, you know. Yep. You don't want all this gonna stop right now. Oh, oh no! What am I doing with my children? What am I doing with my baby? Then the man gonna follow. Yeah, man gonna follow. Hey yo, my woman said. You know what I'm saying? Niggas out, man. Niggas zip, man. Trust this shit to me. A month. You can sit a month. Bitch, I'm gonna buy me about a pound with that bitch. Niggas got, niggas got. Before the 2000 get that, nigga already got 2,800 200 things you want to do with that, that 2000. He's going to line up that like clock. Yeah, nigga's going to line up. <laughs> yeah. And you know what? He's still going to hit them cameras. Oh, nigga's going to be waving yeah. and shit. That nigga's the market of getting the chip today. Man, I feel get so that good, free, you man. know? You heard me? You niggas crazy to wear no dresses out there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it don't even hurt, you know? That's how them niggas talk down here. You don't even hurt, you know. Yeah. I'm gonna get about two more of them bitches, you know. Damn, that shit. I ain't finna stop like these niggas yeah. about living in the woods and shit. Get the yeah. chest. Damn, that shit. I got to eat. Yeah. You <laughs> think these niggas gonna do that shit, man? We in the, yeah, we in the final hour of the chip, man. And you, real, brother. and you can't decide. The Lord got who he's making take it. Yes, indeed. There ain't no decisions on that. Yeah, and he right. got who not gonna get it by no means yes, necessary, yeah. man. Yes, indeed. That's why y'all was shot praying. He said, I pray not for them in the world, yeah, he said but I pray that they be protected from, from that which is in the world. Yeah, he said it. He said it earlier. He said it earlier. Cause you have to be in the world. You gotta be in the world. So the Lord, like y'all was shot, like, look, I'm praying that you protect them from that which is in the world. Bitch, I can't go outside. Bitch, I can't, can't go outside. outside. I'm about to get that. Bitch. I ain't go outside today, bitch. You gonna get that, bitch? You gonna get that, bitch? Go crazy. You know this, but that the brother right. That's the energy of these niggas down yeah. here. He's. He's uh, 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 putting the image of how they be down here. That's yeah, really how they be. We yeah, from here. We been here all, all our life, man. Fuck all that, son. Fuck all that, dog. I got to go get me. You got 7,000 men. They ain't going to me. They ain't going to buy it out. They ain't going to buy it out. They ain't going to come on. Come on, bitch. You got to bring niggas with him. Yeah, I'm about to go grab that safe, bitch. You know that nigga stomp? Hey, man, look, you're I'm about to go do Nigga stand. I don't know why them niggas stand. Hey, man. I tell you what, yeah. that's how Jake do it all that. That's Jake. Fuck all that. Doing Jake and Pro, the yeah, world do a lot of shit. A lot of people, <laughs> they, they say they be like that. I, I like that. He finna find yeah, out. Yeah, bet that up, son. A lot of them, you know. Boom. Bet that up. Bitch, look, you heard I'm dying right now. <laughs> that man said, look, that man said, you come right now, you got a spot for you too, bitch. Come on, come on. Come on. What the nigga be doing? What's Jake doing? What's Jake for real? What's our week? You know why we know that? Cause we was Jake's like that. Yeah, bitch. That's what me? Jake don't understand. We was like that. Yeah, bitch. I'm like that. Two thousand. Like yeah, two thousand. Two thousand. Yeah. Bitch. On the ground. Yeah. Things is gonna rob. He gonna get shot on Instagram live. Too bad. He gonna get his whole hand chopped off. <laughs> you gonna see Jake take out running with his hands. Yeah, Jake gonna start robbing hands. Right? Yeah, they gonna rob hands. Yeah. Wherever yeah. the money at, Jake going for the money. Man. He's gonna have a cooler full of hands. A cooler full of hands. Access. That head suit. They got the head suit. Whatever in your head, he cut the head off. Scan it. Credit head, credit card fraud. You gonna be on trial for? But you know what the same thing happened with the C19. You know, these hoes gonna get bold, man. Cause these hoes gonna put it out there. Don't fuck with no nigga if he ain't got the if he ain't got the mark of the beast. What, what's your status? What's your status? I ain't got that shit. Oh no, I can't fuck with you. You know that's how them hoes do you with the with the sign shit. What's your sign? What's your sign? Not no Capricorn. Yeah, not too big. <laughs> you don't even know what that means. You got the chip? I ain't got the chip. Uh -uh, you can't fuck with me. Uh -huh. You niggas gonna do that shit, man, behind your woman. Hey, All the little new boo you fucking with. You right. 
And them, that's right. And them hoes gonna tell, man. Yeah. Well, they gonna tell the men to bed with that if you can't come in the house if you ain't got it. Because I can't keep, I can't keep what I got if you don't you know got you it. Niggas, you know how you niggas is down here. You niggas. People like, what you just say? Yeah. Say what you just said, brother. Don't what? Say. I can't keep it if you don't got it. You can't, can't do what? Yeah. You can't, can't come to the house. Or oh, you can't come in the house if you don't got it. Them, you the same niggas that can't turn that thermostat on, man. Yeah. In your woman's house. But you don't want shit, man. You can't open the icebox up, man. You a freak. And you gonna take that chip and down freak. Because <laughs> he was like this. Right. Like, what you filming, though, man? He's stealing, a, a, stealing a, a, a video. Bro, just videos. That's it. That's that's I'll, I'll be wrong if I go slap them sideburns on your side. And then he had the, uh, the mustache that do this yeah. on the end. You got to watch oh, yeah. them. They curl up like that. You got to watch them. Like a boy with the musket. We used to shoot the musket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, 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 eat, them, them, they eat cabinets for a living, man. If you know what I mean. <laughs> yes. You got it, right? Yeah, man. But you know, we go, we get in there, you know, you know the shenanigans and things like that. But this man. the truth, man. You niggas gonna get yeah, that shit. Niggas gonna take that shit. You niggas go on the wall, you gonna get chipped up. I knew them skinny jeans on gonna take that shit. That's <laughs> yeah, you niggas, niggas gonna take that you shit. You niggas that twist your hair twist all day. Your hair, you got the skinny. Walk around like this all day. You be a young boy walk with the skinny jeans. You gonna take that shit. Stand like this. Yeah. You, like, you sit on the couch. You got that phone up. Got yes. that hell in your arm, laying there looking stupid. Yes. You niggas gonna get that chip, man. Eating on that fucking shrimp po' boy sandwich, man. And that cereal. You oh, yeah. the one with the ivory when they niggas, sit man. down on the couch. Yeah, you bring your big man. Yeah, 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 man, these niggas. Man, these niggas. It's not going to be hard to chip the fuck of New Orleans, man. It's not going to be hard to chip you niggas in Slidell. Hell no. All the men in the It's not going to be hard to chip you, you black ass niggas in Hammond. Them niggas in Hammond, they ready. And they going to be like this. Me yeah. both, I'm mixed both. They only yeah. got three streets. They only got three All streets in, 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 in Lula and Hammond. They got three main streets. Yeah. Niggas in Lula, y'all look like y'all just got off yeah. the movie life, man. I'm serious. Yeah, they look, they look out of, they look like yeah, not third world, they them look niggas, seventh world. Them niggas Back still, man. Lula, brother. Them niggas still got the car that Mother the King <laughs> drove in down that bitch, man. <laughs> he got some aliens out there. Bro, Lula look a seven wild country, bro. Yes, indeed, man. Where I work at. It's not gonna be hard. They look like a seven world country where I work at, brother. Where, where, where it's I'm not gonna be hard, brother. Yeah. It's not gonna be hard. Yeah. Yeah. Ridiculous, bro. Chipping, chipping the greater in the world is not gonna be hard for Esau, man. Yeah, you niggas, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like with the, for the C19, it wasn't hard to get you black women in line. Yeah, in my neighborhood, yeah, black women walking around the door to door. With the pamphlet, had the whole shit. Trying to, trying to get out of the motherfucker to get to get uh to get the the, 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 the big pumpkin, man. How much more the C19? It's not gonna be hard. Cause you women, you you, you women, you, you definitely that stupid, man. You know you put Esau put a gimmick to it. Free free Yankee number three weaves and shit. That's all you gotta do. Say the weed. Free free spots. Hey, you know. They they all to it. Free lashes. Free lashes. You know. You, you all, you all, you all said you ready to go. Yeah, free donuts. That too. And yeah, then Krispy Kreme. And yeah, they give you niggas out here fried yeah. chicken. Yeah. They chicken C19, man. Give me a chicken, man. Give me the weed. Oh, yeah, you get the weed, weed too. Free weed. Yeah. But why, why, why does Esau do that? Because you know the fuck of dick is simple, man. That's right. We went into it earlier. How do you see the Lord call them started sooner? Started you niggas fall. That's why he call you sheep. You niggas yes. fall for anything, man. Well, they got the scripture that said, the, uh, the wise man, looking, the prudent man looking well to his God, yeah. but the simple, the simple, no, no, the simple pass on and are punished. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. right? Uh, and the simple believe in every word. But it said the prudent man, the man that got insight, wisdom, understanding, he have eyes, his pineal gland is lit up. All right, understanding what's to come. The prudent man look well to his God. But the, the simple pass on, they gonna get punished. Yes, Let me see that sign up. And, and tell you in Revelation 14 that if you take this thing, you can put the thing. Yes, yeah. it it's, not, it's not a rocket science saying the end of the law, like you get it, you can put the get it. Keep yeah, you niggas not ready, like the scripture said, you you not ready to suffer for a moment. Yeah. I ain't moment, getting this yeah. shit. I'd rather be in the nomads traveling yeah. to and fro. Yeah, it's a pilgrim. Cause like I said, these major cities, they gonna set up, they gonna set up these different these barriers to where if you in here you got the chip if you're on the outside you're gonna fend for yourself go do what you know 
this what this what's gonna be, man. These yeah, cities are gonna it's turn it's into it's war zones overnight, man. That's your desire to go in the city, and he ain't gonna be able to. Yeah, through this. Yeah, through that. Through martial law, man. That martial law's going to happen. That means war life. You know? Don't be in war. It's gonna be a war town, a time of war. Please ask these people. Put it all the time, man. Yep. These white, these Edomites, these so called white men, they've been, they've been from the beginning of the time, they've been gearing up bullets, ammunition, top tier. I'm talking about material. What is that? What is that? Material. Uh, no, no. It's a uh, hollow tip bullets? No, no, no. Material. Military grade fucking weapons, man. Yeah. They go, they go to war with two jakes, man. See? Even guilt, like they own when you go into yeah. that five level, uh, yeah. level four, level, level five, four, yeah. level guilt. The regular police have all that shit on now. Yeah. They got shit better than them. They got shit better than them, but you know, even they get up. Yeah. Like not, like you know, boots and helmets, it's, it's up. Yeah. Wait, if I, if I can add Super up. Soldier. Just Super week, soldier. Just last week, I just made a delivery over there by, he might have had to be at least about 10,000 rounds of shotgun, shotgun ammo. Yeah, who that's what? What, 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 what do you got 10,000 rounds for, man? Yeah, you ain't doing that much killing. Pallets. If I can pop this top, pull a shotgun around. For what? It's for coming against, it's coming for you jinx, man. Because they're going to roll it. Because one thing about it, down here in New Orleans, they didn't set up, we went into the last week, they set up, they set up these things called wards. A ward means to be locked down, man. Locked down. They put you niggas in these projects, and all in all, and all it tells at the end, they know where to come get you at, man. Right? right? Just, just like when, when society collapsed last time for Katrina, you niggas lost your minds. You didn't know what to do. You was you was destitute, confused. That's, that's the perfect state to be in, man. Hungry. Like I said, get a get a picture, get a picture of some of that shit. I wanna see if Keisha gonna be like that in that day though, man. Got the Yankee number three weave on, floating down the street, bed built, flat at the back. You know, build like fucking wrestlers. <laughs> like a dope. You know? I wanna see. So niggas, niggas gonna niggas gonna run wild through this bitch, man. Right. You try down like a mile in the street. Yes indeed, Lord. Yeah, the, the men, the real men gonna come out in that day though, man. Yeah, the line gotta come out. <laughs> the line's coming out. That's right. Yes, yeah, yes, brother. Shit ain't shit ain't no joke, man. That's why we out here to preach. All right. To the destruction, man. We in the 110 degree heat, literally, man. That's it. Preaching the Lord, preaching the end. This is gonna happen, man. Hey, let me see that sign. Get the sign real quick. When this come, we ain't gonna be out to eat. <laughs> We're not gonna be out to. It's gonna be a lot of you niggas right there. Look, see him. Gonna be out too much longer. Gonna get, get pulled by you, pulled by your hair. You know. We're not gonna look, be out look, to when this is happening. Look, look at Keisha though, man. What a Keisha is old. A young yeah, Keisha is all about pleasure. All about bullshit, man. See that as pleasure, dead while she living. Which, you, which is some of you niggas all about pleasure too? I ain't say you niggas don't. You niggas don't take a bath from the first five six days. Only on that Thursday you niggas start getting together, man. Right? You, you start you start to take a bath for Saturday, man. To put on them pretty ass clothes and come outside, man. We know about you niggas, man. I'm outside the gates, man. Feet funky than the motherfucker, man. All right, broke as hell, man. Stunned. First, first, like I said, that shit ain't gonna help you in that day, though, man. It's not gonna help Keisha be wagging, dragging, dragging that, dragging that big old whatever you want to call it back, back there. It's not gonna be. It's not gonna help. You want to have militant, militant soldiers out here? It's gonna be killing shit, man. Sedition amongst men gonna be. I'm talking about men gonna be getting on out here. Oh yeah, kill, get it, get it, get it. Get that inside there. You know. See, this ain't no play. This ain't no for play out here. What we doing, man? Get that way, seven when they leave him with the ground. I hate it. Put it. Put the sign back up. They gonna lay y'all even with the ground. They coming in. They gonna raid y'all houses, ravish the women, and then they, right they, and they, bind the strong man. They did it for. They did it for Katrina. They had uh, yes, I, 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 D, what, I W L, I D W. Right. They had uh, Blackwater. What you talking about? What's going on? Yeah, we believe it too. I do. I'm missionary Baptist. I'm one of the owners right now. Okay. No, you good. You good. You're on the one for the But I definitely believe. believe in the mark of the beast? You know about the mark of the beast? I believe in the power of the beast. 
Yeah, yeah, but you know, you know the market of beast is coming. It's here. Isn't it already here in A and Iron? Well, no, it's it's, it's going to come in the form of a uh, uh, C. You ever heard of it? C D C D B C. You never heard of that? You ever heard of the Fed now? Fed now. Fed now. What they convert? Fed now. Like the Feds. Fed now. Where they're merging all the banks together to be one bank. Right, and they they, they gonna they're gonna do something called the CDBC. All right, central central uh what is it? Central, 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 central bank digital, digital currency. currency. Where well, they gonna they gonna make this a new currency? They're gonna make this the new currency of, of, of the uh America. Scan the paper. You gotta scan the paper. All I'm gonna say about this is make sure you have clean water. That's it. Okay. Right. Water. Right. And also, but, um, but yeah, I think that a lot of people... Hey, you're going to need living water, which is this. It's yeah, all the way they live. I agree. I right. agree. Yeah, but I do think that a lot more people need to, uh, mm. like the... It's done. Just oh, yeah, understand, like, uh... It's a canal street, man. Yeah. All right, then. Once you drop a phone out here on Canal Street, man, that that damn that ground been pissing shit on, man. That brother, that ground hard as a bitch, brother. Oh yeah, yeah. But see, this this the point though. The average so-called white woman or whatever she is knows what's going on than the, than the she black knows. woman. She pretty much know she 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 in better shape than the black woman, man. All right. The only, only thing the black woman can tell you about the new latest show going on. All right. All right, who, who's slinging the most ice cream out here? But when it comes to, to world affairs like that, they don't know. They don't know that they don't know that the, 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 the banks, all the banks are closing, man. In the next couple of months, next two, three months, these banks are not gonna close. Better put right? an article in there with the Bank of America. The six on closing in um, California, man. Well, but Cameron started. didn't know. You know why Cameron didn't know? She part of the Edomites. The, the men are in the new. Hey, right. yeah, the brother just talking about the, the bullets. Get fresh water. Get fresh water. Right? Get life straws. <laughs> they know about that shit. Them life straws. You know, y'all probably know about life straws? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Know about that shit, man. <laughs> get rations. Get lots of bullets. I mean, lots of bullets. You see, right? Yeah. I'm going to tell you, you see, right? Kill, too. Yes. Keep trying to kill, too. Yeah. They know all hell going to break loose, y'all can have. Every, it's like nobody don't seem to know all hell gonna break loose when all these things are happening. Hey, every time you go to that gun store, you see one of them ragged ass niggas coming out with Keisha talking about giving that 22. Yeah, that 22 ain't gonna that pink 22. That pink 22. Or that Tiffany color, yeah. Tiffany color Glock. The that purple. shit ain't gonna help you, man. That's right. That shit ain't gonna help you. That's why Long got this nigga, yeah, he big as he big as a goddamn equator. He gonna have a heart attack when the nigga get to busting at him, man. Y'all not ready for shit that's going, getting ready to happen out here. Right? You don't want, you niggas, y'all talk that shit about them country boys, man. But them country boys are not a fish. They're not a hunt off the land. They know, they know the difference between different grapes to eat. Berries to eat, man. What up, huh? All right, what up, what up? You know? They know, they know how to, they know how to go out there and hunt. All you niggas do is hunt, all you do is hunt now. Three from three from two and put it on Burger King, man. And now all we're gonna do is eat processed food all day, huh? Oh, yeah. Well, these niggas don't They're gonna take yeah. that away, huh? Well, these niggas get ready to stop it. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Once they close McDonald's and the processed food, what you gonna do? Hey, you, you're done. When they, they call, call well, man shoes, when they kill that, when they kill that gook at man shoes, you yeah. niggas are done. Yeah. You niggas are done down here. Yeah. Yeah. Purple yeah. stuff, too. Yeah. 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 When they kill Wong Chung, Wong Chung Fu at, 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 at uh, the purple store on the bridge, you niggas are done, man. All right? Because all he's been doing for the last 25 years is selling you niggas them big ass owl wings in there, man. All right? You could be eating owl wings out here. That'd be the damn GMO. Yeah, trick fire right. That bitch saturated with MSG. That's why you got these, 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 these uh, GMO babies out here. Man. Dogs, cat, shrimp, beef, ass, yeah. and shrimp. Yeah. Orange ass shrimp, man. That shrimp, that, that shrimp, it don't, it don't even curl up. It been flex out like this now. The shrimp don't even curl up no more, man. Yeah. Two niggas eat that shit though, man. Eat it up like slop. 
Where else the niggas go at? You didn't go to Cajun Joe's. They just said I got a video, two videos. Cajun Joe's failed to fail the fucking inspection, man. Oh, Something bad ass beat that bitch, man. <laughs> you niggas still in there. Yeah. Niggas squeaky, yeah. nigga. This nigga hit the block five times. Hey, 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 Cajun Joe's Cajun cool, Joe's bro. bro. You see that video with the uh, dude caught that uh, big ass wreck and that Chinese red rock? Yeah, yeah I see that. You see that? Oh. That's the guy. <laughs> He's doing it here too. All, oh, all the little stones right here. Yeah. Up here, I'm talking about. He got big ass red. The red size of that goddamn Corona right there, man. You can't do. He dead red. They still say you niggas the same shit. All these niggas do, man. Don't even get inspected hey, hey, at all. They don't get inspected because they choose the money. They don't fuck up the money. They don't they fuck the money up. So they don't. Yeah. This, this ancient, they do, they do this ancient time, they they let like this shit rock and roll in, man. Yeah. Some of them builders hundreds of years old, man. <laughs> yeah. Bitches infested, man. But they go, they go, they go, they go down there to on Claiborne, that nigga Wacko and Skip uh place, Waterman Chicken and Beer. Go to you niggas should inspect you niggas, man. All right. Man, you got that day old commercial. ass chicken in there too. They've been hanging out in that light all goddamn thing, man. All right. <laughs> Niggas are motherfuckers, man. Niggas are motherfuckers, brother. Yes. We know about that. The reason why we can talk about it is because we know about you niggas, man. That's right. Oh. Niggas. Give me some of that ghetto punch. Fucking ghetto punch old, oh, man. That Nola remix. Yeah. Shit crazy, bro. I went, oh, hey, man. That's just FFA, man. Jake better get it together, bro. Which I doubt, but both of you niggas is, is not gonna happen, man. Only the, the righteous elect and the one third is gonna, is gonna get get in line, man. Everybody else is gonna pretty much die, bro. Yeah. Them to my die in bulks, by the thousands and shit, man. By the millions. Come on, come on, yeah, let's get it. It's uh, St. Luke chapter 19, verse 41. And when he was come there, he beheld the city and wept over it, saying, If thou hadst known, even thou, at least in this thy day, the things which belong unto thy peace, but now they are hid from thy eyes. Right, so these are the things that belong to people, peace, or meant peace at the time. So we're in a time of war. When you go in Ecclesiastes 3, say that's a time of peace and there's a time of war. We have entered, officially entered the season of war. Nation is against nation. Matthew 24 is down there in full effect, man. Only thing the stage is set, things has got to happen. That's it. Everything is set already. Go ahead. For the day shall come upon thee that thine enemies shall cast the trench about thee. So the enemies have already cast the trench about you. Got you niggas in the ghetto, which when you go into that world, it means insignificant places, man. Now coinage all off. All right, when we blitz, you got the uh, Army Corps of Engineers. They know, all right, this is the section of seven wall niggas, nine wall niggas. It's all broken down. You got FEMA that do the 10 parts of the city. They got the whole America broke down. They're going to blitz from here, hit the waterways, cut this off, drop this right here. They already know what they're going to do. You brothers need to go look the at that. The trenches around. Go on Google and put in FEMA executive, part. FEMA executive orders. FEMA executive orders. And they, and they show you in executive orders how they're going to cut off all the waterways. Yep, waterways, yep. These fucking highways that Jake didn't, they're going to just, you know, I'm going to bust on that, No, man. This is going to be cut off. They're going to put barricades. They're going to put up uh, docking stations. Hey, where your papers at? Where your chip at? I ain't yeah. got it. They're going to board you on the FEMA bus. Yeah, you are going to get boarded to a damn where the FEMA camp from? The big right. They're going to check for us everywhere. Yeah. You're going to get put in one of these, man. Sure. One of these big FEMA camps, man. And they block right? And they got, they got these, they got, they got these, these, uh, all in Atlanta, they got these coffins already ready. Because they know mass debt coming, man. DHS already bought millions of bullets, man. How tip bullets, man. Get it, get, get the some water. And they, and they, and they got, and they got, they got, they got it ready, man. And, they know, and, they, and I'm gonna say this: they know already know they got to deal with two niggas in New Orleans with supreme prejudice, man. Oh, they coming down. With two they gonna come down hard. Yes. They coming down with that the business. biggest shit, man. See, you niggas all in that, you in that, that no limit masterpiece spirit. Yo, really? Oh, test oh, they don't go with that shit, all, man. Uh, Hurricane, uh, Katrina, they already know. They already know. They already know the black woman is gonna do this all day. Oh, oh. Everybody gonna put two fruit green in here like a bowling ball, man. They're not gonna, they're not gonna play with you niggas, man. They already know. They, like I said, one thing about Esau, he has everything lined up, everything based on analytics, man. Numbers, statistics, all right? 
diagram. He know every. He know what. He know, he know what the most aggressive jinks are. Yeah. Right. He know you. He know you niggas are here. You niggas in the Memphis. You niggas in Oakland. You niggas got your ass in Chicago. You niggas in Atlanta. Yeah. What they call it? Zone six. Zone, six, yeah. zone this. Zone that. They got that shit for a reason. Right. So when they get ready to move in, they gonna move in, man. And he got the. What you, what is called right? You may know the red. They got the red. Red, the red, red, red list. Yeah, like, yeah they know. Yellow, they know yeah, all the threats. Blue. The low minimum threats. The high minimum threats. What right, areas? Yeah, they like, know where the murder capitals of the world that we come and blitz that hard. Yeah, Big yeah. bullets, drones, and, and, and grenades and knock their ass off, man. Yeah, right. this, yeah, a lot of you gonna, a lot of you gonna get tech, get your ass torn by them little birds. Yeah, yeah, they call them little little yeah, birds. Bro. Little bird. Okay. Patches and shit. They're gonna, they're gonna bring out the big guns for you, shit, man. Nobody dogs. Say, bitch, they were shooting ass on a helicopter. They're gonna drop them super I'm soldiers real. in some places, shit. too, y'all. Yeah. Bitch, I dropped my fucking. I shot my car that ran from that bitch with hearts. Damn, man. That's where the nigga be, man. Super soldier. Kind of shit. Say, slap that bitch. Nigga hit the corner, nigga came around with some shit bigger than Shaq on the left. Yeah. But it's gonna be too late, though, man. They're going to get that boy with them tanks, too. They're too. Now they they're got go, a lot of them tanks been on George. They're going to just, go, just go drive through on George's fucking house with the tank, man. <laughs> just drive through the whole house. They had them big 50 cows and I be tearing stuff up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Hey, through, man. That's a nigga. He just depressed. Man, any nigga playing Usher in a single cab Dodge Ram is depressed. His wife cheated on him. Yes. She, she, and she hate him, too. She hate him. <laughs> She gave the nigga yeah, three scoops yeah. of that ice cream. Go ahead, bro. Go back to God, it says for real though, man. This shit, this shit, look at this shit, man. Look at this shit, man. This, this is ridiculous, man. Man, back in the day, nigga used to come to Canal Street with some class. Nigga had an outfit on. Nigga smell, nigga smell good. Women smell good. Nah, it just, it just, he come out here looking what's in the discussion, man. Nigga had some type of honor. Coming on Canal Street. Now nigga come, they come like he fell off the fucking GNO. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes. Then tall and be like it been rolled over. They just come out here still hollering at some shit, man. This shit gone, brother. <laughs> the thrill is gone in America, man. Only it's only time now for the green light for the Lord to really do his thing, man. Go ahead, bro. Back in Luke 19. Verse 43, yeah. for the day shall come upon thee yeah. that thine enemy shall cast the trench about thee. Right, so and the Lord is, is kindling fire on the earth. Hey. But what would he saying it already been destroyed? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. And they shall, and come past thee round. Yeah, they're going to come past you around. Which, them tanks, you see all this military equipment, or why you saying on YouTube and different places around here. Where the brother live out of Aaron, you always see a load of them coming in. And they are, they're along these railroad tracks, and these different places, they go in the warehouse and they're setting up in you Jake cities, man. All right, yeah, like, go ahead, brother. Like when you go, I'm gonna tell you one thing, where they hide, where they hide tanks and Humvees at in the woods, you um, when you come out of Kenner, instead of going straight to Baton Rouge, you make that turn to go on 16, you start going straight, you go over that little first hill, you start seeing them little houses by the water. You mean 13? 16. I'm coming out of Kenner? That's 3 right there. 16. 16? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. They're hiding them. I've seen them on some bridge and shit, man. What soldiers are there? That's 55. Yeah, go ahead. 16 by how? Yeah, 16 by the east and the west end. That's when 16 starts. You kind of throw me off by Kenner. This, this, they call it 16 going to, going to 59. And compass thee round and keep thee in on every side. Yeah, they're gonna keep you in on every side. Alright? Because they're gonna according to second address, they're gonna bliss the houses, man. They're gonna they're gonna cause one of these not a lockdowns to happen, and they're gonna come door to door, man. Go to dope. Take this, get down, and get on a bus, man. Yeah, they gonna, the scripture says they're going to leave. The scripture says they're going to leave no stone unturned. They're going to leave no stone unturned. I mean, they're going to be searching diligently for, for people, man. They did that during Katrina. 
when you run it at the house of Katrina, it was ex of the military to show they had winning now. They got markings that they gonna put on now to show they winning that house and search that house, man. Yeah, the old Edomite bitches with the with the pistol, they tackled her ass, man. Yeah. All right? It was on her ass, man. So how much more? It's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be it's gonna be nasty out here, man. We we telling you, but it's gonna be far worse than that. You gotta be that's why you got it's, it's important to come back to your nationality, man. It's important to start serving the, the true Heavenly Father of the, of the Bible, man. Not, not, not this guy, man. But getting, getting in line with who the real power of the heavens and earth is, man. Right. All right? Come back to the stronghold. Yeah, come back come back to the Lord. Because if you if you just out there calling yourself a black man, you just, the Lord named Jesus, God, you true. You true, man. You know what the Lord said? Meaning that they should, should say what? Lord, Lord. Lord yeah. Meaning you, you, you're going to be calling the Lord uh, the wrong name. Some of you are going to be calling the right name. The Lord still going to say, yeah, apart from you, me, you workers of iniquity, yeah, man. You. you got people know the Lord my name. All for the, yeah. Like a light. All But these cities are going to get besieged. They're going to turn the lights off, man. A lot of you need, you ain't never seen, you ain't, when the last time you seen the walls, the lights off, man? I did. Yeah. blood. Come on, pitch back where you can't even see your arms in front of your face, man. It got like that. It got like that from the tree. Really, I was in it. Six days. It got like that. Yes. Got like you hear sounds, screams, apparitions, shit going on over there. <laughs> Don't think they hear us. They got that night vision. That's how the light go out. They got that night vision. Oh, that too. They gonna see you. They had a Katrina. They had the yeah. night vision. They shot. They were tearing niggas right here in the Albemarle right there. They were tearing niggas ass up. Night vision. Yeah, that was the test run right there. Yes. That was the test run. That was the simulation. They say. Jake was shooting at the helicopter. I seen Jake shooting at the helicopters right here by the, they was doing interviews on top of the, the, the police station right here. The yeah. helicopter be flying, niggas shooting them rag ass AKs. Yaka, 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 yaka. He was a president then, that was well, see, Bush. No, Bush, yeah. Yeah. So really then, they said about, by, 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 they use them night visions at nighttime, by the time morning comes, Jake be all in the hallway dead, yeah, taking out the yeah. windows and shit, dead. Yeah, yeah but, cause see they had, they had something called Blackwater, uh, yeah. private military troops down here, man. Yeah. And what the guy said, it wasn't enough action. Now he, he was doing so much killing, he wanted enough action for him down here, man. And they gonna do it again. This time they gonna send NATO through this bitch, man. The blue caps. And they, they're not gonna play with your ass, man. You know, foreign nations come in here. It's up. It's up. That's it. What Cause I we were, hey, we went spoiled those other nations in different places, right? Through rape, robbery, and murder, and rape and murder, on pillaging, all this. Them people know they hate Americans. When they come in here, keys them, boom, get down. They don't care about grandma, big mama. They ain't spend nobody, old, no young. They ain't gonna reference the old or the young, man. Yeah, they gonna do what you done to them. They gonna do what you did to their people, man. You like mad men, sparing none. Sparing none, that's, that's right. We got that. That's it. And they gonna have a pocket full of blue pills, too, man. Yeah. Ready to put it in that work. Breaking it everything. Big Keisha, small Keisha, tall Keisha out here, dressed half naked. Yeah. They gonna bring you to Pound Town. And they gonna put it on Jake yeah. ass, too. Them niggas, yeah. too. They gonna pop Jake, too. Oh, <laughs> man! Yeah. Children, the man, yeah. everybody getting popped. Cause you did it in them. You did it in Iraq. Yeah, you did it. Yeah, you did it all in Afghanistan, yep. Fallujah, Yemen. You went over there. And you, 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 you were doing the shit, man. Yes. Raping the people, taking their resources and shit. America is known for that shit. That's right. They call it. They call it you American troops, uh, the green eyed devils, because the, the night vision goggles you have on that night. And they said you come in that bitch and you. You gang rape mothers and shit, man, in front of their children and shit. That's right. That's what you do. So what's what, what's Chris said? What you done to done to one people is gonna happen to you. That's right. That's them dumb. Yeah, over there, chapter one. What, yeah, uh, you what? shall cease to spoil. They shall CTV, spoil, CTV, you. That's right. spoil you. That's why Isaiah, Isaiah, the thirteenth chapter coming to play. That's right. Well, your house gonna get ravaged and ran through. Your wives gonna be ravaged, man. Yeah, Isaiah, thirteen. Uh, it's gonna be a pretty. Like I said. If we gonna be in the midst, but it's gonna be a beautiful thing, man. We won't even get a crown of lava to end on some niggas, man. Hey, like we said, we sell lava, they can lava. Yeah. yeah That's right. Y'all gonna mock them in that thing. That's right. Lava was made. It's gonna be a beautiful thing. Probably you walking us right now. It's funny seeing, seeing so called Negroes on the corner with them funny clothes on, man. It's funny right now. <laughs> oh, yeah, we crazy right now. Crazy. Come on, man. <laughs> Y'all gonna mock him. Yeah, because he walked up. He said, Be not deceived, the Lord is not mocked. That's it. And you mocked the Lord through his face. Right. The Lord ain't on earth. 
right? So what represents the law? The men, his men. So you mock them, the law, I'm gonna mock you when I laugh, and you in derision? The law like that's gonna be my men laughing at you, man. Yeah, I know we're gonna laugh at your ass, man. We gonna laugh. And then collab. Yeah, so you know that's gonna that's gonna turn out bad. That's gonna turn out bad. Go to town. That diaper program, man. I got one. That diaper. This is uh, just the back of what you were saying. We're gonna be in the midst of these troubles, but hey, these are the times that's we've been waiting for to see these people finally all those humble, all those proud looks, those lofty looks get humble, and the men of the Lord get exalted in that day like the gold of Ophir. But this is Job five and twenty two. At destruction and famine. Thou shalt laugh, neither shalt thou be afraid of the beasts of the earth. Yeah, and we're going to see it. The Lord going to put us right here. The Lord said the righteous shall scarcely make it. We're going to see you people get jacked up. Hold on, bro. Hold on. Huh? Why? You're going to see a nigga get his ass torn to shreds, man. But it's not going to come to our way, though, man. That's going to be the beautiful part because we put the work in in order to be exempt from the bullshit, man. That's it. That could be sad and cry, according to Ezekiel yeah. 9, man. That's it. And get that mark at the watch. You niggas ain't, you niggas ain't sad and crying, man. You a part of the problem. You a part of the problem, man. When you see a nigga walking down, down the street, on on, on Canal Street, sagging his pants with them dirty ass ethical drawers on, with them eyes on it, that nigga a part of the problem, man. Right? Smoking you. weed. Yep. You a part of the problem. To permit you from Right, you, if, you, if you're not against evil, even you wait. Man. The Lord don't let you straddle the fence. Look, but you gotta understand the Lord like you're on the right side of the love. Don't Ooh, you man. permit you promote, partner. Ooh. That's it. Oh, that don't got nothing to do with me, son. Let them people do what they do. No, we calling that shit out, man. Wickedness, man. It's wickedness. We calling it out. We ain't all right with it. And the Lord ain't all right with it. That's why you gonna judge this place, man. Rightfully so. Oh, Bro, break it out, right? Break out what you got. Huh? Yeah, right. Because I have called and you refused, I have stretched out my hand in no man regard. But ye have said not and not all my counsel. Right, so his counsel is the words of the Lord, which starts with the prophets of the Lord to give you instructions on what you should do, yeah, what you right. need to do to save your life, huh? Yeah, so that's the 50, uh, 56, 58, 56. Yeah, but you, with that proof, none of his counsel, all right? The counsel of the Lord coming by way of the scriptures, which the prophets deliver unto you, man. Where it at? And with none of my reproof. And with none of, it, of his reproof. Because when you reprove, and they, they say they handed him that rebuking in the gate, or that reproving, if you reprove a man, uh, a righteous man, he gonna love you. You rebuke a wicked man or reprove a wicked man, he gonna hate you, man. Go ahead, brother. Verse 26, I also will laugh at your calamity. You gonna what? I also will laugh at your calamity. And how, oh, how great will the calamities be in that great and notable day of the Lord? All right? They gonna have newly created creatures. You gonna have famines. You gonna have the missiles coming. You gonna have, uh, uh, what, what it is when you eat each other? I mean, eat your children, cannibalism. All right, you're gonna have a belt chasing you, then a, and a, and a, a, a line gonna meet you. Come on, man, it's gonna be non stop problems and issues, man. Yeah, so All because you didn't want to serve the Lord. Excuse Go ahead, brother. I will mock when your fear comes. That's when your fear gonna come. All right, go ahead, brother. And when your fear come at this desolation and your destruction come as a whirlwind, yeah. when I when distress and anguish come upon you, yeah. Then shall they call upon me that this person anguish. Meaning when you when you witness, right, when you witness your folks and other people get shredded to pieces out here by any form of whether it be animals, whether it be people, swords, whatever, you won't be in anguish. You won't be you won't be hella scared, man. What's the matter? You ever had that be so scared and feel like your hair's on your neck standing up? Your heart going to your ass, man? How you gonna people gonna be, man? But I will not answer. They shall seek me early. And you know why he ain't gonna answer? Cause they're gonna be, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord our Lord. The Lord hey, the, the the righteous, the name of the Lord is a strong tower, the righteous running into it in the same. Meaning 
you can't run into the name of the Lord. Meaning what? You you call on the name of the Lord. You work in the name of the Lord, man. Yeah, I'm right under the shadow of his wings, man. She had, she had that anguish face. Yeah, they call know. on Jesus. With pains, they face shall be uh, smitten with, with uh, yeah. white, uh, uh, blackness and, and pale. They face shall wax pale. Which is going to be that shame, that confoundness, man. Like they all are talking about blackness, man. They're going to be smiting. Oh, smite me, oh mighty smiter. Go ahead, brother. Jesus! But they shall not find me. Uh, verse 29. But they shall not find him. Because they don't know the name of the Lord. Hey, just like just like Katrina. When that nigga Bush was flying that plane around. No. You did no, not call it no female. It was a, what is it? Uh, first, uh, big ass plane. Uh, Air Force One. Air Force One. Oh, Air Force One plane? Yeah, yeah. I saw a lot of shit. Flying around. I never seen that nigga. Why we're calling on FEMA, man? FEMA! Well, FEMA didn't help you niggas, man, for five days. Six. Or more, you know? The whole the whole ordeal. Yes. You got niggas right now still, you got niggas downtown still talking about uh, FEMA affected them, man. Yeah. And you know it was Katrina. Man, yeah. I still can't get that business started that morning, man. Katrina yeah. fucked me up. Nigga, screw, man. That was over 2017. 19 years yeah, ago. For real, bro. That's old. Hey, this, this place still through. Go, go to the night wall, man. The Lord night wall. It's still, it looked like Katrina just happened. It never got rebuilt. A day ago. It never get rebuilt. Houses was on top of each other back then. Yeah, I know. No, it was the one was right here. That bitch was down the street. In the middle of the other block. But you got niggas still don't believe that it was an inside job with that. Right? They, they blow the levees up. We heard the big boom sound. We Right here in the convention center right here. Yeah. Everybody heard the song and you scared to death, man. Yeah, had, had a black older woman that was a block away from the levee. She had the videotape and she went to she went to, she was on C-SPAN. My mom missing. Yeah, oh, my mom missing. You ain't seen no more of that. All the tape. You played the tape one time. All you seen her on the on her porch. As the Katrina, she turned like this, you see kaboom. Kaboom. You seen the explosion. Finish. Then they got rid of her though, man. Got rid of her. They gonna do more. I'ma say this. I think they gonna flood the shit out of this place, man. Yeah. You know? They did that to flood it. They, they always show those, they always show those uh Louisiana maps. In the next such and such years, it's underwater. They got plans, they got plans. Both sides got plans for this bitch, man. Hey, Louisiana so wicked. I think the Lord gonna let it go on the water and blow it up with a missile under the water. Well, the miss is gonna bring the water with a new one. You know, let it be going to water and blow it up with a missile. For real. Smack this bitch, man. <laughs> yeah, but this place do for one, man. Look at the people. This, this panic came around slow. Look at the people. Everybody frolicking around, high, doped up. Giving into marriage. Look, 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 look. Come on, man. You look like a the black guy going this out here. You, you crazy, man. Yeah, demons on. He is a demon. He is a demon. Where was your that was, that was the, the definition of stretch for the next, man. Medicine. <laughs> Medicine, man. Huh? Brew, man. Awesome. It says. He got it. Take brew, man. Go ahead and finish that. It says. For the day shall come upon thee that thine enemy shall cast the trench about thee uh -huh. and compass thee round yeah. and keep thee in on every side yeah. Go ahead. and shall lay thee even with the ground. So they're gonna lay y'all. They're gonna lay y'all down, man. Even with what? Mm. The ground. Go ahead. That's and thy all. children within thee. And they're gonna lay your children down, man. And that laying you down don't mean they just gonna lay you down on the ground. They're gonna lay your ass out, man. And that day, why lay a bunch of people on the ground? He's gonna have a, a million people laying on the ground, man. They're gonna kill you, man. They're gonna kill you, man. And they're gonna kill your children too. All because you don't want to serve the Lord. Get that chip, you ain't wanna get down. They're gonna put you in one of these. To torture you, man. These are gonna be the new detention centers of America, man. All right? And like I said, like we always go into the one of the biggest ones is in uh Guinea, in Louisiana. One of the biggest ones in the Gulf South. And I'm gonna say this too: your local Walmart can be turned into a concentration camp within an hour. Within a within a couple of hours, it can be turned into a female camp. All right. Let's, let's, let's look at the bigger picture. The Smoothie King Center, the Superdome, a big concentration camp. Yeah. All right. And what you taking a picture? Oh, he. You know. 
this is, but this was coming though. Right? These FEMA camps are already here, locked and loaded and ready. You believe that? You know, you know you about this, that? Though? You know about that? You believe it? Yeah, it's over a thousand FEMA camps already locked and loaded and ready to put Americans in. All right? And they're going to do it by force. They did it for Katrina. All right? Through uh, Black Water. All right? Through this government shutting down this place. And they're going to do it again. Okay? They said, they said, them FEMA, they said them, the Black Water troops was down here weeks in advance, man. Already knew it was going to happen. Already knew it was going to happen. Simple. So you people don't, you don't know about the heart, the heart machine. How they can, how, they, how down in the south, in Louisiana, they've been altering the weather. Right? There's it's a reason why it's so hot. There's a reason why they direct, they are uh, with direct uh, wave systems, they, they direct hurricanes straight over here. Right? And these are here. And they're going to put a lot of you Americans in it, man. Black, white, Asian, Arab, seven war hardheads, East Beast, it don't matter. Yeah, they ain't going to just get Jake's. They gonna get they people too. Yeah, they, got, they getting everybody. Man. Yeah. Yeah. Then they got a, they got another guy. I think this one to know about. They got a, they got another guy that was on reported on one of the ships videotaping. They had over hundreds, oh, yeah, of thousands of goddamn uh, guillotines being shipped from China to over here. That's right. Why is why they shipping guillotines over here? Because this government is all about organ harvesting, man. Preserving the organs. So when they cut you, when they cut your head off. They're gonna preserve your organs, man. Because of you jinx. You so-called Negro, you hold on the earth the most biggest healthiest organs there is, man. All right? But that's what it's all been it's what it's been about. During uh Hurricane Harvey over Houston, you had they were recording a homeless guy, and this was on the news. It was like, hey, they put they put karagmas in people and don't go get on those barges, don't go get on, on those ships. Because they're killing people on there and ain't nobody coming back. The same thing happened for Katrina. You know, and I, and I can call the people up That's and right. tell you. There was, and they brought showed they brought up the video. There was, there was, just like in the purge, had that big 18 wheeler with the guy with the gun in the back. They was doing that shit for Katrina. All right? There was actually, uh, had it to where some people and, and their babies were getting chipped by a red cross, man. So a lot of you Katrina babies, you got the chip in you. Stealing cars and shit. Them niggas messed with monsters, yeah. man. Yeah, you niggas, man. <laughs> you nine babies. breastfeed, breastfed babies. You niggas dangerous as a bitch, man. Yeah, Similac. Yeah, you babies that, that they've been raising that Similac. Niggas dangerous, boy. Niggas dangerous. Tell you, man. Oh, man. Well, anyway, like I say, Mr. Mott, Mr. Isaac, Mr. Mrs. Mrs. Mosses, man. It's documented. You can go find that out. You can, you can go research that. A lot of the children from Katrina that were taken from their mothers, mothers and fathers at the time of Katrina were chipped. The Red Cross chipped them. Right? And, and that's a fact. You can go look, like I say, so Jake don't, don't research a goddamn thing. Don't look into a goddamn thing. But they'll do this though. They get their babies to the doctor and go wait in the waiting room. Meanwhile, they, they, they're putting the, the chip in them. It's going to happen again. Right? This is this was knowing this is, is gonna divide the families even more. You might have a deal with a situation where your woman gonna wanna take the chip. You ain't gonna take it, man. Bye bye. Go ahead. I'm gonna take the chip. Hey man, you're gonna have to make a decision. The trooper said, what the trooper said though, don't go down for your stuff though, man. Stuff. If, if possible, if it come down to that, let it let hey man, you you need me back in the kingdom, man. And that stuff goes into a, it says a righteous woman. Yeah. A woman that was with you useful. That was useful to the man. Stuff means the woman. It means that woman. Jay gonna go back on her, so I gotta go get my woman. Yeah. The woman off of your hose. You know, in which we had we had chicks around like that. Jake know what to do, still don't do the shit, man. No. You know? But Jake hardhead, man. Jake, Jake wanna do right what he now. wanna do. You gotta see, we gotta do what thus said the Lord said to you, man. Right. Don't take the chip. Do not take the mark of the beast. All right? Even if the Lord said, even if you got to suffer, even if you got to die, don't take that shit, man. You going to die if you take it. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> man. He ended this, took your soul out and died. No matter. You need to get to the point you want to be like this because telling your people, they're going to tell on you. They're going to tell on you. 
Go to the government on you, man. Yeah. See? That's why the scripture says, so why give not um, nothing power over you while you live? Women, kids, children, nothing, man. Job, nothing. A lot of these people don't really gear themselves over unto the things of the world. They haven't really fully trusted in Yahweh while y'all was shot. They haven't set their love on them, man. So the Lord, like, I'm going to give you over until a reprobate mind. More without judgment, man. All right, most of these people are reprobates. The Lord, like, look, they they fuel for the fire. And it's nothing you can do. We got to pray on we We don't get the fire, right? All right? We're in the know to know what to do. But we got to pray that the Lord allow us not to do it, man. Okay, we can say we ain't going to take it. But if the Lord wants us to get it, we get it, man. You know? So that's why we said we, the, we pray we the whole free life, man. Yeah, it's about time. Us. I mean, point made. <clears throat> like, like the Lord told Ezra, I think it was Ezra. He told Ezra, if the Lord grant you to live. Yeah, man. If, if he grant you to live, if you see the end back there. And Ezra was the elect man. He knew the Lord was dealing with him. All right, but Ezra knew also he had to come back in reincarnation too. Boy, it's me. He spoke about reincarnation in Ezra. Ezra's 14, different. Ezra's 7. He was speaking about it, so he knew about it. He like, war is me. Who shall say it's me in that thing? So he knew he was going to be here, man. You know? But let's clear out. Bring that priest up out. We'll run us God. We, we get up out of here. It's back in Luke 19 and 44. <laughs> and shall lay thee even with the ground Come on. and thy children within thee, yep. and they shall not leave in thee one stone upon another. So you ain't going to be able to hide from the hand of the Lord. This is the Lord working through them. When you go to Romans 13, all right, the, the powers that be are ordained of the most high. So when they come looking for you, that's death coming for you. And tell you in Sarah 14, I remember that death shall not be long in coming. Well, it's coming. That's it. That is coming. All right. And the only way to escape debt, you gotta be in the Lord. Ain't no way you can't you can't back door yourself on the chariot. On the chariot right there. You done ran from the Lord all your life. You just try to lift off and grab the bottom of it and get on it. How you going to sneak on the, the chariot with the elect man and then you snuck in? How you going to come up some other kind of way, man? That's when the nigga won't get right, though. In the last minute. At the last minute. What the other nigga that's Bart Simpson. Bart Simpson. Bart Simpson. Bar Simpson. We call him Bart Simpson. <laughs> he look just like, he like a black Bart like Simpson. Simpson. With the big eyes. Yeah. All he misses is that jagged head, jagged yeah, head, yeah, headline, yeah. man. Other than that, he look, you put a cap on him, look just like Bart Simpson. Like Simpson. Talking about, can I wait till the last minute to come in? I won't want to play Russian roulette with the Lord like that, man. Well, you tripping. Wow. You know, now you in, now you on uh, uh, the wire and diamond with green hip. Sitting outside the goddamn yeah. liquor store, man. Asking people for 50 cents. This is crazy. One of the most dangerous liquor stores yeah. in the East, man. In the East. Crazy. What, what would the Lord do? You for saying you the Lord, he put you in the most dangerous place. Like you did with David, put as a Uriah, put him in the most fierce part of the wall and get your ass put to death. Yeah, man. That what the Lord gonna do most of y'all. Put him in the hottest bed where all the killing, everything. Go, go put that nigga in Chicago. That nigga gonna end up in the in the heart of the middle of Chicago, man. The Lord might, the Lord might let you move on the white side of town in Gretna. Get yeah, your ass, and get your ass roasted. <laughs> For real. Hey, them people in Gretna doing Katrina, they oh, shoot man. you, they shoot you till you catch on fire, man. Jake ready to that man said people shot him so many times, all in his ass, everything, man. Hey, then they came Take out there. They came out there with them big hard ass, them big hard ass uh uh rain boots. No, them, them Wrangler jeans, them big hard yes. bitches, man. They still at Walmart. They had them them white beaters with them two gold chains on, and that tattoo that sitting right there. Or that or that anchor, or that fish. Tattoo right there. It was shooting the shit out of you, nigga. Yes. Right? Yeah, one nigga said he, he he contemplated about jumping in the Mississippi River. The fight was coming at us so bad, man. But hey, got shot all in his eye. It was a whole race ride that went down across the river in the LGS for Katrina, man. A lot of you, a lot of people don't know about that. You were cutting right now. You were young. <clears throat> they, they said if we were shooting anything brown in a brown paper bag, man. One, 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 he didn't mind. He shot, he's, he, he got claims of shooting 36 niggas, man. He said, what you did with the bodies? I just, I just piled him up over there. Yeah. Hey, he might have shit gonna hit the fan, man. He you, gonna, you, you niggas gonna see how really how the white man give a fuck about you, man. Right? You gonna see how them, you gonna see them horns come out these devil's heads, man. 
for real, for real. When they life on the line, they gonna show you. If they always did, they're gonna show you how much they, they give a damn. You don't put a gun in their hand, any kind of gun, they gonna they go they gonna they gonna try and wick it out with you, bitch, man. You know? Yeah, that blessing gonna come in, man. He ain't gonna lose it. He ain't gonna use it in vain. Because, because thou knowest not the time of thy visitation. Yeah, because they didn't know the law of visitation. They say gonna come up on you as a thief. Hey, we tell the them, whole world. We telling them right now. We telling them right now. This the Lord telling you, brother. We just saying what the Lord told us to say. Nothing else. Nothing extra. We not adding anything. This is what the Lord said, man. My bad. I see the turn. This is uh, 2nd Edges 16 and 22. It says, For many of them that dwell upon the earth shall perish of famine, yeah. and the other that escape the hunger shall the sword destroy. Yeah, the sword gonna destroy you. So even if you escape the famine, the sword coming for you. All right? You ain't, like, the plague's not gonna be slack. I tell you right. that. Ain't no, the plague's not gonna slack. The pestilence coming is gonna be diseased. People looking to eat people. What that EMP movie was? EMP 360? Yeah. 260 or whatever. Y'all gotta you, watch that on his own. They show you happen when the lights they go. They show you happen when the lights go in the in the excess amount of time. People right? lose it, man. People lose it. When, when your stomach touching in the back of your spine, you, you lose your goddamn mind, man. Yeah. It's, it's gonna be hot. Look at this It's saying right now, it, it busts out right now. Yeah. Take it through, man. Through. Lights turn off, it's hot. Can't stay inside, you gotta go outside. Go outside. Uh, second address 16 and 23 and the dead shall be cast out as dumb yeah the dead shall be cast out as dumb ain't no funerals in that day sooner there ain't gonna be no funeral jake don't got no fucking money anyway jake poe all right yeah, it ain't gonna be it. no funerals ain't no casket and slow it singing and fly will bring village. all right they call it pot pirates uh, yeah, where they uh, bury out when you don't got no money? Yeah, part of the village. Yeah. Oh, those bodies was floating <laughs> in Katrina when they had the little water right here. Yeah. They was floating all in the water. It was coming from back here. Yeah. They don't even bury you six feet with that shit. They put you two feet, man. Yeah. <laughs> put you on top people and shit, man. No caskets. Go ahead. Give you one of the wooden caskets. Give you a wooden casket. It said, and no man is locked in. There should be no man to comfort them. Yeah, no man gonna comfort them. All right? Dead bodies as dung upon the earth. They're gonna say blood is blood gonna be high as a, 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 horse, a, a horse's bridle. That's his hoof. Back in his ass. But it's gonna be everywhere like that. Go ahead, brother. For the earth shall be wasted and the city shall be cast down. Let it cast down. And what we tell you done. We tell you these cities, these these cities that you live in are gonna become war zones overnight, man. Right. All right? Gonna see these buildings tore up, cars on fire, people looting. It's gonna be wild, man. And you gonna become a casualty or what? People gonna be running yeah. in clicks. You gonna see all? You gonna see Aaron, Aaron Brotherhood? All right, Ku Klux Klan gonna be running through this bitch, running together. You gonna, you gonna see some shit, man. Every nation gonna be yeah. they, they coming. These niggas gonna be running around here, robbing and killing just because pillaging. Bro, you gonna see the you gonna see the best of the worst out here. Why should you say we, we went into early? A man gonna desire to go into another city, you're not gonna be able because you're yeah. gonna have FEMA checkpoints. All right? You're gonna have Edomites having their own. They did it for Katrina. Yeah. Actually, like we were going to that, that DVD. Yeah. Them Edomites say, man, we used to cut down the trees for Katrina. Yeah. Like a tree right here, they, they cut it down. The block the yeah. neighborhood up. On that end of the corner, block it, block it up. And you have people that stand on their, on their porch, on their balcony, waiting, right. yeah, waiting to see anybody browner than, brown than the brown paper bag to kill them. So guess what? Katrina was over what? 17, 18 years ago. 18. Less technology. He got more 18. technology and more bigger guns now, man. Not to be 18 years. No. Through, man. Niggas in the, and then Esau know it. You niggas are fat. You drugged up. You in the best condition. You can't run down the street. All right? You niggas dumb, stupid. You, you, anyway, that's why we said we can put a lot of you on the front lines for war, for World War Three too. What you do before you slaughter the cow? You fatten them up. 
that's what he did. Did he fatten him up, gave him McDonald's processed food, dumb him down, dumb them down, keep eating, keep eating, keep eating. Then they're gonna take that shit away from you, man. And then you guys gonna be on a slim flat plan immediately. Yeah. Yeah, take, let me see, I'm serious. Take, take away these five, five for five from these niggas. Niggas gonna lose their mind, man. Dad for the bread. I got a shrimp whole bun, son. I got a pasta. Look at that bitch. Open the bitch up slow. Oh, my cousin, my cousin, he just opened the plate up slow. You see all the steam come up. Look at that bitch. I'm about to fuck this bitch. Well, he gonna take that away from the nigga, though, man. He cool. Put, in the, put, put one of these black ass niggas in one of them woods back there. I don't know what to do. Nature, birds, true. Then we, they so bad here. You got swamps. So I know you ain't getting there. I know yeah. Jake ain't getting there. Yeah. Jay can't swim. They can't swim. Yeah. Jay can't really swim. You are guys, Jay. Nine out of ten, Jay can't swim, man. I'm gonna run in the woods. There's water in the woods. Nigga, at some point in the woods, you gotta hey. run into water. You go down there, <laughs> dribble though, hammer. They got spot as big as your fucking head in, in the woods. The Gators, alligators, snakes. They just walk on the land, come after your ass, man. Snakes. Right. They got snakes. They ain't as fat as they got them pole in that woods. You, right. you got more enemies in the woods than on land down there, bro. Yeah. Change the summer. Run in the woods. Everybody gonna run in the woods. Then they got the more Cajun ass, the more I'm talking about them deep, Boom. deep. Huh? Boom. 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 back there. <laughs> we ain't gonna better fuck with them, man. They been yeah. back there all their life. They gonna shoot you. They gonna, gonna eat your ass. They gonna eat your ass. With them elbows, I'm talking about them niggas that sit up there in the elbows doing this all day. Yeah. Turning. Yeah. Niggas yeah. turning all day. Yeah. Them yeah. niggas. Swamp people. Swamp people. Yes. You won't be back there. Yes, indeed. That's not a religion. Man, you know what I mean? It's, 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 a, it's a natural. It's a, really, it's a nationality. All right? A law of man. It's not, it's not a religion. It's a, it really is a way of life. It's not a religion, though. It's not a religion. Because like this, really, our nationality was our nationality was, 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 was taken from us, right? What's it? What's getting it to me? Uh, I lost it. That was just continuing our, our heritage. That I gave, given thee. It took. It took our. It took our nationality from us. Told us we were black, we were African American, Negroes, Hispanics, Guatemalans, Puerto Ricans, right? And they put us. And they put us. They put what we know as Christianity, baptism, Catholicism. Roman Catholicism, they put it all over us to control us, man. Because they know one one key thing about these people, these people are these people had a zeal for the most high, right? Meaning a spiritual connection to them. That's why out of all the books in slavery, you, you, you can read, you couldn't read the Bible though. Because they knew if we read the Bible, we was gonna find ourselves, man. It's gonna wait, gonna wait. But like I say, these are the names that the Lord knows by in the Bible. These are the names that our oppressors, our, our so-called so-called white man, gave, giving us through history, man, of slavery. Oh, yeah. It's the book of Jeremiah, chapter 17, verse 4. And thou, even thyself, shalt discontinue from thine heritage. And what our heritage was, calling ourselves Judite, Ethanite, Levite, Simeonite, Zebulonite, Ephraimites, and so on and so forth, man. Right, understanding the laws and commandments, how to how how to how to, how to, how to uh, serve the Most High, keeping the high holy days. Those are things that the Negro, that the Native Americans, are supposed to are supposed to know and keep. But guess what? The Lord, the Lord put the curses on us, man. Hey, you, you never you never thought in your mind, damn, we're the most talented, we're the most we're the best singers, the best dancers, the best everything that come everything there is to come to this society. We're the best at it, but. When you look at us as a whole, we living in the slums, the ghettos, the projects. Why? Because we came against the Lord, the Lord our power. We're going to finish it out. It says, I will, I will cause thee to serve thine enemies in the land which thou knowest not. And this is the land that we know is not. All right? And we, we are serving our enemies, man. That's the key point, the key word, enemies. All right? 
because we came up against the most high. The Lord, the Lord had a contractual agreement with us. It's called in Deuteronomy the 15th, Deuteronomy 28 and 16. Yeah. Right, Deuteronomy 28 68. That's it, Deuteronomy 28 68. I don't see this in that when I see that. Right. 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 I'm gonna say that. Wait. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's what I would ever do. And here's the religion. It's more with religion means to be fine as a worship. So we got right quick. Just so you know, because you know it'd be up like the only religions. But, it, but ten, it's not a religion. It's not like a religion. It's not a religion. Like people, yeah, yeah. You, know, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, like Christianity, they, different they, things they, like that. With uh, yeah, a Baptist or with a, a Baptist or, we, or religion, not dead. yeah, we, we live a way of life. That's we default. Go by God's heavy law. You're right. Y'all right. 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 You're right. We right. right. do it because we not. We know we not. They not yeah. supposed. We pious. We do God's natural thing. We pious. We not a religion. Religion is is a system, a systematic state. We have what we have as Hebrews. We born into one thing. Serve God. All right. Let's serve look, God. Look. And serve I got you. I got you. No more. No less. I'm. I'm gonna add to you. Go ahead. Uh, James 1 and 26. Yeah. If any man among you seem to be religious. If, they, if you see, this is if you go ahead. And bridleth. And bridleth his tongue. And, and bridleth not his tongue, yep. but deceive his own heart. Yep. This man's religion it's is vain. vain. Okay, go ahead. Pure religion and undefiled before the Most High and the Father is this. Yeah, so he's telling you what it is, bro. To visit the fatherless and widows in their affliction. To do which was commanded of us. So like the elder said, that which we're doing to go back to our heritage. This is what we did in our heritage. All right, go ahead. And to keep himself unspotted from the world. And that's how we stay within the truth. So that's what, so when they say religious, they talking about a systematically set up. This was organic from the Lord. Through our word, law, statutes, and, and, and commandments. So the word religion, of religion. The word religion itself religion. goes back to religio means to restrain and hold back that's what religion does to you right, right? you you be right. really taught by the commandments of men right because like i say in the, right. most of when you look at you start you start looking into we know we don't yeah you start looking into religion and looking to the, the origin of religion it was all set up for, for control basically basically because they wanted this the money money so in the midst of in the midst of the roman because really the roman the roman catholic church controls all religion Right, even 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 Islam. Islam is a, a, a Islam is nothing more than a, a controlled religion. Even with the Book of Miriam, why does a, the why does the Arab, Arab Arab book have the Book of Miriam in it? Because it started by Roman Roman Catholic Church. So what they did to restrain and hold, to restrain, to keep you back, they, they, they teach you that to try to control you for money for money sake. That's why they, they, even, they invented that thing called what hell. Hell was hell was invented to, to control the people in the church to give tithes to attend church for money purposes, man. You know? We are we out here, we don't ask for your money. We don't want your money if need be. Now if you give us money, cool. But we not we out here for you. To wake you up to your to your nationality, man. Alright? Because all these religions, really I'm gonna say this, all religions were started by the, the force of the sword, too. All religions. In order to get you to, to, to worship their, their gods and their deities, they, they used the use sword to do it. They used the good for the... They used that good? Look on, they used the good for evil. Like they turned the good things to evil. That's why it's for us, like you said, that's why it's for us. There's no who we are. Just pray and who we are. Yeah, yeah. Right. Because if you don't know who you is, then somebody, you're doing for somebody else to tell you who you are. Yeah, you at their mercy. If I gotta, if I gotta, if I gotta, you gotta come to me for everything, and then come to me to tell you who. That's why the scripture tell you, give me uh, Revelation eleven and eight. All right, because it tells you, the them other nations didn't put us at rest. What they did, they just told us any goddamn thing. You black, you African American, you are you are Mexican. All right, with those those are those are nationalities really started by them. You know, the bywords, the, the, the scripture calling bywords and proverbs and bywords. You are Puerto Rican, which means rich poor. Are oh, you know, a, a Puerto Rich people, man? All right, go ahead. This is uh, Revelation 11 and 8. You got it. it says, and their dead yeah, body shall lie in the street of the great city, which spiritually is called oh, yeah, Sodom yeah, in Egypt, 
where also our Lord was crucified. Yeah, these are the dead bodies. Oh, yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Verse yeah. 9. Keep going, keep going. Verse 9, it says, And they of the people and kindreds and tongues and nations shall see their dead bodies three days and a half, and shall not suffer their dead bodies to be put in graves. You see that part right there? Why we three three days and a half is three hundred years of slavery? Why they seen us in slavery, in serving slavery? They, they did not suffer to put our dead bodies in graves, meaning to put us to rest by telling us who we are. Hey, why have you in captivity? You know, the truth is like that. Y'all power is different than our power. That y'all power is the Lord of the heavens and earth. His name is Yahweh. They didn't do that. They gave you this nigga, man. This is your God. This is your God. Matter of fact, you a black man. Matter of fact, you are African American. Matter of fact, okay. We gonna put we gonna we gonna put you in the night walk. We gonna put you uptown in the Calio. All right. They didn't they didn't do that. They didn't put us to rest. Really, they dumbed us down even more. They turned us against each other. You see another black? You make them rap song. Boogity boo the boo talk about killing. You keep talking about niggas minds on killing black other black men. Nigga load that gun up, that magazine, every bullet he put in there, what, he, what that bullet for? Another black man. That was that was taught. That was that was actually indoctrinated to us, man. Cause back, remember back then, from the Rock Kim days and shit, they were talking about empowering you. Getting out, getting getting get getting from under the yoke of the white man. Now niggas do what? Step on your grandmother. That's what niggas talk about killing you. They had to destroy that shit, man. CRS one day. They had to destroy that shit. Two by six. Two by six. Two by six. And then, when, then right after they killed them, niggas, what they set up? The prison industrial complex. Come on, brother. Hey, we get out of here, brother. We've been, we've been, we've been here on the hunt for a minute. <laughs> So, again, man, another another week in Babylon. Oh, Lord, how long, man? You got to pray. I was telling brothers, you got to pray for shorter days. You got to pray that the Lord keep us from coming out here. Once the Lord put the prophets up, the judgment coming. You got to pray to get out of here, man. All right? I was telling the brothers that, man. Pray to, for the Lord to take us off our ways and by ways that we may go into our kingdom, man. All right, so, you know, Lord willing, we pray that that was edifying until the hope we elect in the door that cleaved to the body. So with that, we all give infinite honors and prayers to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Ka'kadadah. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Salutations to the Akim that's pushing the truth and sincerity. And to the next time, we're going to say Shalom. 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 Shalom.